I'm all about peace, love, life, but I don't take disrespect from nobody. So, yeah, I, I, I got, yes, I got into I it, um, um, with my sh with my sous chef at work, talking to me all crazy and shit. I'm like, bro, first of all, don't talk to me like that because I'm your right hand man. Whatever you need done, I get it done. And you coming? Oh, we don't need you. This and the third. I'm like, hold up, you just are you mad because you're not used to somebody telling you no? Like, bro, I'm not your bitch. I talk that shit to my all the time. Don't you fucking tell me no. Straight up, like, so, like, bro, listen, like bro. you gotta tell them. Don't listen to this. You're all, you're all, you're all my bitches. But guess what? The show is live, and we're going we're, live, we're, and we're, we're open. Live. We're Kick open Rock for business. Welcome my to you. the Retro Renegades. We are the Retro Renegades. We are proud members of the Gamers United Guild. Thank you, for everyone, for showing up. Please let us know in the chat if you can hear us. Because if you can't, none of this makes sense. You, you just see graphics. That's all you see. But if you can hear us, depending on then who's in the chat, I suppose. It, it makes things even better. So Tim, today, you, you're so, here, so, so don't, right. don't say what's up to me. Like, say what's oh, no, up right I'll, now. <laughs> I, I do it just because everyone else speaks to that. It's just to get the chat going. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> we we have a stacked panel. I'm gonna go from left to right to talk about who's here. I'm gonna I'm gonna skip the regulars and get to them at the end. We have special guest Doggy Dog. Say hello, Doggy Dog. Hello, everybody. Thank you for having me on again, guys. Uh, it's great to be here. You're uh, very welcome. Uh, much you, love. Much I, love to the chat. Thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in. I told you Sunday morning would get you on soon, doggy. Look at that. Here. Look at that. Just <laughs> yeah, like... man. I appreciate it, man. I love being on this show. The show's great. You guys are all great. So, uh, yeah. And you, you're a man of your word. You're a it's man like of your magic. word. Thank you very it's much. like magic. Well, he, he did slip yeah. me 50, too. Yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> you about to tell about it. <laughs> we also we also have all the way from Belgium, Frommish. <laughs> Hello, my friends. Eat that, lots of candy. I think that's a fraud Flemish. I'm just saying. <laughs> that's 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 a new Italian Flemish. That's nice. He sounded like a, a fucking <laughs> leprechaun, didn't he? <laughs> Top of the he's morning like, to you. He's, yeah, looking for, he, Irish. He's, yeah. looking, he's, he's looking for his lucky charms. 
It depends on how much uh, candy he's eaten that day, too, by the way. Um, <laughs> we also have, all the way from the UK, Timmy! 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 Oh my god, they killed Timmy! Timmy! <laughs> Thanks for having me on the show again, guys. You know, that's what's going to happen someday. Timmy's not going to show up to the DM in the morning, and we're all going to say, Oh my god, somebody killed Timmy! <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you bastards! And it, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the prodigal son has returned. Jeepers creepers! What's happening, brother? I'm back, retro bitches! Bye, damn it's been time. a long time, Jago! Fucking What's time, up, man? buddy? What up, <laughs> We're it's so glad to have time, you back, man. brother. We're so glad to have you back. I've missed you all. I'm not trying to sound uh, lameish. But, you know. <laughs> 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 but no, no, no pun intended, right? <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> you know, that's, I missed you guys. I'm right. ready to have a good time. Well, that's good. Well, before anyone can have a good time, there's really, really one thing that has to happen. I got you. Ready? ready? Yes. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Sweet tea! I saved, it just, I saved it just for that occasion. I'm about to open up to nope all week. You're supposed to say cherry beer. You're supposed to be flamish, Clouds. Come on. Cherry <laughs> <laughs> beer. So bad. <laughs> Tony Juice! <laughs> so, everybody, we're playing. Today we're play is Alex Kid Day, so we're playing. Alex Kid DX, and everyone's going to say, well, there's no retro. Well, fuck you, it is retro, because the original game came out on the Sega Master System in the late 80s. So eat a bag, eat a bag of dicks, and watch me play this masterpiece. You mean, you mean eat a bag of... <laughs> eat a bag of Alex <laughs> Kids. How's that? <laughs> and so, yeah, so this game here is a remake, and you can switch between the 8-bit the version and the All new right. version. So, and... I've not played a lot of this game, so I'm going to fail a lot, and I don't give a fuck. It's going to be fun. How much is this game? 25 bucks. 25 bucks. Yeah. But if you, but if you, about right. But if you want to experience, yeah, yeah. If you want, if you want to experience all the next-gen features, you have to pay an extra 10. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you want the director's cut. <laughs> director's cut. That's right. <laughs> Uh, next gen feature that's called us Hohima Director's Cut. Well, you need that new generation of features to go between worlds of 8 bit and regular, right? So yes. they're both running at the same time continuously, so you're going to need that. Wait a second, someone, need, someone needs to narrate. Can someone else narrate? It's already gone now. Uh, gone. And this is where <laughs> the story the begins. For the story begins. Okay, so, and so, this so, okay. is where the story begins. Okay, so check this Mount out. <laughs> Eternal. Okay, okay, are you ready for this? Watch this. I'm going to hit a button. It's going to turn to 8-bit. It didn't happen, Jay. What Whoa, happened? Yeah, what's going on? <laughs> what the hell is it? It's a delay. Awesome. It's Class, like magic. statue. It's like yeah, magic. That's awesome. No, this is Framish. <laughs> Fraudish? Framish! Frodish! 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 Yes! Ah, looks better in Masuko! What's up, brother? Big Nav! Pong! So, let me know if the audio is still good, guys. It's just... I can't tell, because I'm playing the games. It's not my job to pay attention to that shit. It's your jobs. Pong, so is the ring of rookies of the year. I have a job? Do I get paid for it? What? You do. You do get paid for it. You get paid in love. No, 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 I, no, I, no. I give hand jobs out, so. <laughs> Promise has a question. What's Promise the question? question is if I work for you, do I get paid when I go to bathroom too? Do I get bathroom breaks? <laughs> we'll, we'll have to take it out of your vacation pay. <laughs> your vacation pay. <laughs> <laughs> We're sorry. We're sorry, Fromish, but this is this is North America and this is the way we work. If you yeah, don't yeah, like you it don't get, you don't get paid for launches either here, just to let you know. Yeah. <laughs> I have to say you do though. I have, I have to say I grew up on the eight bit in the eight bit era, but I prefer this version. Just saying. Oh, me too. Nicer, me, me, me too. Me too. <laughs> yeah, because like to go back to eight bit and try to play this that game. Does, it's like, this version does look pretty cool, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. 
Nah, I prefer the 8 bit. Oh, but it's no. cool you can it's cool you can switch back and forth. That's real cool, you know. Yeah. Just let your eyes Imagine how different it looks when you switch between the two. Yeah, yeah. It just takes, it takes me back, makes me, you know. Nostalgic. Speaking of that, makes me wanna Oh. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'm confused. Yeah, that, uh, Continue. That old version hurts my eyes. I mean, you can't see those old peepers anyways. Oh, oh back! My, back my is my in, the, in, the, in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> it's your, your eyes are great. It's just your mind that's fucked. Like, yeah, can, we get yeah. a, uh, can we get a retro uh, age verification here? There is no, no flame machine. We're all good. <laughs> how, how, <laughs> yeah, exactly. How old? We're all. We're here? actually all about are, are, are you verified retro? <laughs> Flamish? No. Or the, you the, verified. The, the real Flamish? No, he's not verified. Really. Can the real Flamish please stand up? <laughs> yeah. uh, no, 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 real Flamish cannot stand up. No, yeah. no he's, having, he's having back issues right now, Jason. No, he, he no he's, got, he's got an erection. He'd rather Damn, take the, Christy, he'd rather take the zero. <laughs> yeah. uh, Crispy ate him. Did, 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 did my did my voice break his back? Is that what you're saying? No, not your voice. What you guys no. do in your own time? He gave, it, he gave him some of that crispy <laughs> truth. <laughs> hold, hold on. Crispy hold, truth. On. <laughs> hold on. I don't know if you guys know, but the real Flemish has to have neck surgery. He oh, yeah, actually Flemish goes in surgery. August 9th. Yeah, that's yeah. too much. No, no, he got his raises. Oh. <laughs> let us oh, let us pray for let us, let us pray. Let us pray. Exactly. <laughs> moment of silence. <laughs> no, moment. There we go. <laughs> it was a moment. Dear Jesus, Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> please That's all lay you hands on Flamish's neck and uh, heal him now. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. <laughs> Anybody see that new all access commercial? Holy yes. Shit. That was great. Oh, that's that's so, so funny. Damn funny. Yeah, that's good. With, with, the old back, with, the, with the old Backstreet Boys, I swear. So. Gotta go I, will look, see how, I, will I look, haven't see seen it yet. I haven't it's, seen nice, it. it's nice seeing those guys putting out some cool commercials, too. You I, know, haven't, man. I haven't. Look at ironic, it mate. That's what I'm saying. Because they. <laughs> They uh they had that commercial during like I've seen now, it during now, the NBA now playoffs. Now, now, has become Australian. <laughs> Not yet. I'm British. <laughs> I said it always all the time. Flemish is Fraudy. I'd say it. He's Fraudish. I like beans and toast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Beans and toast and hobnobs. Oh, oh. See, where where is the, where's UK Daz for this shit? Like he, yeah. he like. Like, oh, what? Oh, what? Fuck off. I speak what? the Queen's English. What? What? Fuck off. What? 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 You, know, you what? fucking funnies. You think this shit is funny? <laughs> what? Oh, man. No, I haven't seen the commercial because I ain't got time. Did this shit come out today? I barely heard there was a new switch. You ain't got time for that. No, I'm too busy during the fucking it's, day. It's, no, no. it's a new <laughs> Green switch? It's yeah, a, yeah. It's, a, it's a OLED screen switch with basically the same internals with a better audio. Yes, hey, 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 in, a land port, in a LAN port. Oh Come my on, god. Oh, 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 my gaming capabilities. Oh, oh, Nintendo, oh, oh, welcome, to, oh, oh, welcome to the early 2000s, Nintendo. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. How hey. about, how about, hey, upgraded sticks, you fucking assholes. Like, yeah, really. Can you, can you, or, can you say, like, hey, like, we have fixed uh, when, the when internal you, issues with our when, controllers? When you say yeah. upgraded sticks, they can't you, say that, though. When you, when you, when you say upgraded sticks, do you mean they won't get drift until six months after <laughs> instead of three months after? Hey, yeah, wait yeah. a second. Upgraded <laughs> sticks. Hey, I thought hey, hey, it was 28 try. hours of gameplay. Before it starts drifting, I, I, that'd be nice. Uh, no, they guarantee uh, they guarantee drift this time. Well, no, they, oh, there you go. I, I thought I thought I thought you, you got upgraded. You I suppose right. Wait a second, guys. I thought you got upgraded. Drifting game. I thought you got upgraded sticks when you started using Viagra. <laughs> <laughs> well, the fucking switch, damn sure needs to start using it. Now. That's gonna yep. be a switch XXL. <laughs> No, just XXX. There the you go. The, <laughs> switch, the switch XXX extra large version. <laughs> it's triple X. No, I swear, honey, it's an upgrade. 
need to have oh. a bit more resistance than that Jay slaps his joystick. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I, 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 I watched... Uh, Listen, I'd be worried if you didn't slap your joystick, put it that way. <laughs> well, well, here's here's what I will say. It, it didn't make me want to buy one. It, it, no. Like, literally, it, it, it was like, it was like, oh, this is a, a 90s Nintendo commercial right here. Like, this is exactly what they did in the 90s. I'm okay. just telling you people. You know if you hook your... Uh, right, right. You know, you know if you hook the original Switch to an OLED, OLED TV, it's the same fucking thing, right? That is yeah, a good that's, point. That is a great point, Jago. <laughs> <laughs> that is a great point. That's the same thing. If you hook this same this Switch, this new Switch, up to the same 4K TVs, it's still going to look like a big... Bag of ass. You can't make it. They haven't As, improved. They haven't improved the graphical fidelity of the game, so it's just exactly. gonna be just gonna be a clear piece of shit. When you when you dock <laughs> this thing, when you dock this thing, it's still gonna be sitting on the same toilet that it fucking was before. Uh, yeah, yeah. All they gave you was a fucking new screen here, and like Crispy said, they didn't give you no new sticks, no, no Viagra. No. They didn't no, give you no, fucking nothing. You're gonna play. You're gonna play on the toilet with the lights out, though. <laughs> like I said, like I said before the show, Noof said it best on, on, on Twitter. I knew it was. Bunch of crap when I saw you. You're, right, you're right, Chris. You're right. For right. double the money. Yeah, you Chris gets your time, hands on You're it. sitting on eighteen hundred dollars. Yeah. My kid wants a, a, a switch OLED because that's what they saw. And if they got the bag of money sitting next to them, they'd be like, "Here, here, take it all. I don't care. Crispy. I just want my kid to be happy. That's it. I'm, I'm getting <laughs> one now, and you can all get up for five back. minutes. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm getting one now, and I'm, I, I've got to put one of these on eBay. These things go for fucking even 3000 on these things. Oh, yeah, dude. Like, dude, like the Series X, I was so lucky to get it for regular price besides having to buy an no. extra controller. But really, I, that would be a pain in the ass actually selling one of those things on eBay. Wouldn't that, like, be scary actually, like, sending that out and just hoping that you know what's you know what's really weird and a lot of people don't i have this scorpio edition 1x see i wouldn't I want to sell, sell that it. either on ebay i you can tell it for seven hundred dollars right now i got the same scorpio one. edition i got two yeah. of them yes i got the same one i sold mine at gamestop because i had to sell the, it the, you that. can sell it for at least what you paid for it oh no. yeah i went to gamestop i told them i had the scorpio no, edition no 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 eBay, oh. whatever, dude, you, you just put it out $500, they're going to start bidding, and it's just going to go up. Yeah, I've, I, dude, I've, I've seen that on eBay here recently, because I was I was just on there, I was looking to see what they were going for, because I wished I wouldn't have sold my S, because I wished I just had an Ultra HD player in the bedroom, I was so stupid, I sold my S for 110 bucks like a year ago or some shit. But anyway, yeah, I saw people were bidding real high on these Xbox One Xs and shit, and I, I sold mine to fucking GameStop, Earlier this year for 175, but it had that thermal paste problem, so I just oh yeah, yeah. It's like there you go, you know it worked, it worked, it turned on, but it would get like it got hot one time and it said don't set it on the carpet or some shit like that, and then I heard people had problems with it, and I was like oh shit, so I did, I saw I babied it right until the Series X came out. No wait, I put it in the bedroom. Anyway, I babied it and I sold it to fucking to GameStop and. You know, I but you could have fixed that problem, and like Crispy said, you could be selling those on. Those things have a good resale value now. I, kind of I, wish I, kept it. I, I would resell, I would sell my Scorpio, but once I get a Series X, a Scorpio is gonna go go in the living room. Oh yeah, keep it. I mean, yeah. it's a, it's an awesome machine, and on top of that, you got a 4K HDR TV. That yep. it, I mean, go try and buy just a a 4K H uh, uh U uh, Ultra HDR Blu -ray player. player. Yeah, yeah Blu-ray player, and they're fucking yeah. like a nice one's three. Two, three hundred bucks, you know, and you get all the apps and they all play native 4K or whatever yeah, on this Xbox. Yeah. So, yeah, so you're, you're yeah. good. I mean, you yeah, got to get in there. Like, I, I wish like, I've got all the money for PS5 and it's and a Series A because you just, I just can't find a goddamn thing. Oh, shit. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think, uh, you know, personally, Jago just kind of don't even bother right now. I think hey. they're going to drop a huge amount of consoles when Halo and Forza come out. I think if they're going to, they're waiting. You know hey, are I mean? any of you guys still looking for one? Like, if I actually, like, if I'm, because I am just get lucky sometimes. Like, I found a few PS5s for, for friends and shit. Like, if if I run across the Xbox Series X, anybody here still need one? Like, pick it up, order it, somebody will take it? Yeah, let, let me know. Let me know if you okay, want Okay, Jago. I yeah, see Jago yeah. lighting up. Okay. I, I just picked one. I just picked one up for my boy, but I couldn't find any regularly in stock, so I bought it all well, access. A I Series X, right? X. Yeah. Not X right? I, I, I could have I had a Series X. Yeah, Jago 
Jacob wants X. 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 Uh, yeah, I could have had a Series S by now because they've actually got them in at Walmart. Yeah, with the light works. And, and, I, and I, was, I was like, those can piss off because they don't have a fucking hmm. disk drive. No. Yes, fuck, exactly. No. See, no. exactly. Yeah, you're, well, the performance you're, is different too. So I mean, you're, yeah, I don't care. I, I don't care. My my, my, my Xbox One X is fine. And I, I, and, yes. And yes. I'm not, I'm not gonna limit whether I can buy physical. Fuck that. No, no, that's good. So yeah, if I see a Series X, I'll, I'll, I'll yeah. buy that. We'll, yeah. I'll get a hold of you. Ship Let you me away. know. I'll, 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 yeah. Or you, or you, you know, if, if if somehow he can't do it, like, dude, you, you can make double the money. I'm telling you, if you can get one in your hands, you can make. I just, at least a couple hundred extra dollars if you want. I just, fuck yeah. Fuck I fear yeah. selling that stuff on eBay because I'm afraid like you'll send it to the people and the customer's always right. So if they complain to the. Uh, uh, yeah. Customer service there, and they say, "Oh, this guy sent me a bunch of rocks in a box." Yeah, yeah. and then, and then they'll take it out, and they'll be like, and they'll, and, and they'll do that. So that scares the shit out of me, because then they'll yeah. take your shit, and you're out five hundred bucks. You know? Yeah, yeah. Like, yep. And then only you take, just, only, only takes wow. one. Only takes one asshole. Yeah. The party. <laughs> and that would be my luck. <laughs> that would be my luck that that shit would happen. So no, like I said, I I I I scored a PS5 around. Uh, it was right before around Christmas time during that thing, and my friend bought it off me. I sold it to him for six hundred bucks. Okay, you know, so I, you know, I got a little. Yeah, you made fifteen bucks in taxes. You made fifteen bucks after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. was it? Yeah, I made. Yeah, fifteen. Yeah, that's bucks what I did. You know, I so. got two PS fives. Now I got two Series Xs. And did the same thing. I made fifteen I would, bucks out of them. I would have kept the PS five, but I mean, shit. I don't, you know, I just I wouldn't have time to play all that, and while I play, you know, my main stuff on the Xbox and stuff. So you know, it went to good home. He plays that stuff all the time. Anytime he comes down here, thanks me and shit, you know, he's, he's so happy. I, I could have fucking bought a PS5 a couple, like, a, about a month or so ago, because somebody uh, that would work with my wife was actually selling his PS5, and it only had it, like, a month. I was like, she's like, you want it? I was like, fuck no, it's not my main, it's not where I game, you know, all the time. I really have uh -huh. to do you, you know what? But you know what's funny? A lot of gamers right now are looking at what PS5 is, you know, doing with their, like their older games and it's like dude i can buy this for 60 or less on the ps4 and it's gonna run the way i want anyway because they're really like they say they're upgrading everything but it's like it's not really an upgrade it's it's it looks a little better but well, I mean, you're charging a full seventy dollars to get a director's cut. Like, what the fuck is that? Well, like, one thing, <laughs> like one thing, like King, because I just caught up on the Iron Lord podcast from Sunday today, and like King David, he was talking about, you know, the, uh, the PS5 actually got Dead Space as exclusive because of the fucking SSD slide. He's calling it Dead Space. It was fucking hilarious. I'm like, that still hasn't been addressed. You know, the other shit, the, the, the file transfer shit, seems like a pain in the ass. I'm like, I'm good for that for now, man. Plus, they already talking about like because of the chip shortage. Like redesigning the motherfucker. Hey, I'm like, nah, I'm good. Did I'm they good. ever? I'm confused. Like, did they ever? Because you never really hear a straight answer from anybody that's actually likes the PS. You know, they like it has PS5 and they they want to fanboy it out. Did they ever fix the whole storage solution for the games? No, no, no. They still no. Like and I and I said that in spring in one of the chats. I was like, you guys are championing this shit. I, I guarantee you, by fucking September the first. Labor Day, whatever you want to call it, they still won't have that shit fixed, and you guys still just let you. The reason you, why they haven't got it fixed is because it will overheat if you try yeah. to have anything in yeah. there. So that's yeah. the reason. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Thank you, Timma. Yes. yes. Well, maybe all those sheep need to shave off the wool and they'll quit overheat. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that's that's why uh, that's why King David was calling it Dead Space. They had Dead Space exclusive inside the PS5. Motherfucker, <laughs> motherfucker, <laughs> motherfucker it, you know it's, it, it, it does nothing. It's a big hole there, and it's, a, yeah, it's, well, it's over half a year, and they still haven't fucking addressed it. Yo, <laughs> check this out, right? Yeah. Okay. So, yo, yo, go ahead, doggy. Oh, I, I just I thought I yeah I just I thought I heard they did something mm -hmm. to like fix it somewhat, like you could maybe like put some games on a, a hard drive or something, like an external but it's still they didn't fix what they said they was gonna what no, they, 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 do, they right? haven't they haven't addressed the internal SSD yeah, well, i mean no. nope it's just an empty bay still you can't do jack with <laughs> yes yeah, so if they did they have to right. try and sort out the fans so that it'll keep it cool because it'll well, get really hot no? we're, gonna, we're gonna run yeah. into a we're gonna run into a ps4 uh scenario timmy where the fucker sound like he's about to take off <laughs> <laughs> right, so so check this shit out, right? So, shout out to the Iron Lords, by the way, because um, King uh, King and David then brought this up a while back. But if so, VG, uh, video game awards. Everybody thought Xbox was gonna announce a new something for Game Pass. 
but as we all saw, they announced a new Xbox Series X, right? Yeah. Now, fast forward to now. That slap, Sony got slapped in the face with that shit. They had no idea that was coming, so I was like, aha. So, rushed the console with that. Now, fast forward now, if you really look back, this is basically the 360. This is basically the 360 and PS3, uh, 360 era, 360, the 360 era all over again, but reverse. So this time you got Sony has a, um, a, a, a you know, an issue with their system. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Back then, 360 had the on the red ring of death. What up, man? Dress so pool, it's basically, lady. It's basically like it's basically like three bit. What is up? Three bit. Yep. Yeah, what up, three bit? What yeah, an so awesome it's basically, crowd. It's basically like rolls before us. It's like. It's, it's crazy. Right. Uh, it, right, it, it sucks. It, 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 su it sucks. It, it sucks. It sucks uh, for Sony, but at the same time, it's like. You, well, you, are you talking about where they were? Are, are you talking about where they were addressing how like the, the the market leader always falls on you know falls you know on their laurels and they get complacent? Oh, it happens every generation. If if you go back and notice, I mean, like the one who's always the market leader always becomes complacent. And mm -hmm. they're the they're the ones who the next generation right. are are like basically uh, I ain't gonna say I hate using more and more anti consumer bullshit or just bullshit in general mm -hmm. and then and then they get their ass kicked if it, it flip flops right. every generation it, man like uh, just like hey, whatever lady. it is. You gotta come out of podcast sometimes we are go ahead doggy so far yeah this, lady would be you, an awesome but so far awesome, this um, awesome guys. This generation, you know, the last generation either hasn't really mucked up too much that's affected them that badly that they've now gone to be not the leader. So, yeah, yeah they yeah. made mistakes, but they're still it's... the leader at the moment. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, of course. It's just but, like that stuff over the course. weekend, right? Th they had, like, um, with the indie developer coming out and saying these guys are a pain in the ass to work with or they choose the big guys over us and that kind of stuff. And... I remember, like, wasn't that about a year ago or something, uh, something like that. And remember when Xbox came out, and everybody was, oh, we've got this, we've got SSDs, we're going to do this and that. And I remember Sony said, we're for the hardcore, we're not worried about indie games anymore. Does anybody remember that last year? I was thinking that when I heard him talking that on the... I remember that. What, what, up, yeah. what up, brother? Right? They were talking about how they're only for the hardcore games, and they're going to focus on... Big yeah. triple A's. Yeah, the big triple A's. You guys remember that? I was thinking, because I heard they were talking about this topic last night or maybe this, this morning on Booms or something like that. And I, and I remember thinking that. I thought I remember. I wanted to type that in the chat. I was like, now nah, just bring this. Yeah, those. I remember they said that last year when Sony was just. They were they were throwing a lie here, throwing a fucking lie here. The SSD will give you a blowjob. The SSD, this. Uh, the, um, what, what, we got. We're, you, we're someone said blowjob? Oh, get yeah, that! <laughs> Hey, what? SSD, man, they probably Doggy, let's be honest, thing. the system, this one, Andy, what up, bro? Once, uh, once uh, Phil happening, announced Andy? that Series X, they got slapped in the face and they rushed the console out. Well, yeah, exactly. I honestly I mean, believe yeah. the PS5 was supposed to come out this year. Well, yeah. Okay. It, it, well, what you're saying... I could be wrong, but that's well, what, what, I what you're saying, I'll, I'll go with you. I'll go what, with you. What you're saying, doggy, with what they did say, because I remember them saying it, somebody saying yeah. it over there at PlayStation... Yeah. Well, 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 Probably line seeing, line. Well, what you're seeing now, they've, they're proving that they were being honest. With the indie devs coming out and saying it's a pain in the ass to work, you know. To, to yeah, work. then that's what, yeah, and that's where I was going with they, that. They, is, they won't lie. In. They, they, go they weren't lying. Them. Exactly. They were letting all their fans know that, it, you know, and most of them, they don't, they don't like indie games anyway. They just said they just they're want basically, to make it, you know, like, so. They're basically like a football team buying all the Galacticos, isn't it? Like, <laughs> the fact they're always and, doing uh, all the, the yeah. triple A's, etc. It's like, the I play they have the Galacticos to keep them doing well, whereas after a while it can backfire on them. And... Yep. Yeah, and I don't think all the indie developers, like, you know, like you say on that show earlier, they're not going to leave PlayStation or nothing, but it just, now they're going to try, and it even said on their, their thing earlier, uh, join us this Thursday for fucking, uh, uh, whatever the hell that thing's called, uh, State of Play. State of Play, yeah. yeah. State of Pay, and then we're going to have a bunch of, uh, Deathloop, and third party, uh, third and and something that says something about indies in there, you know. So, so like, and that's all the ass kissing they got to do. All the indies are not going to leave PlayStation. But no, 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 no. That's what they, I'm saying. They're not going to leave. They'll. It'll be. It'll be a lot harder for them to get new indie devs to be. What they just, want to be on their They might platform. lose, like that Kena game or whatever. You know, like they Bridge might lose one of those. Yeah. You know, Kena Bridge of Spirit. Yeah. 
Part of that, yeah. what, 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 I'm, what I'm saying is, you know, and you're saying is, they keep going down this path. What you're getting at is, um, it's going to be a lot harder for them to secure new indie indie devs in their games if, um, not, you know, wanting to come to their platform if they're people, if, oh, if they're oh, a pain oh, in the ass oh, to work oh, with. People, yeah. we're not bashing Sony. Dude. We're just no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Nope, Sony, Sony's the oh, market thanks. leader for a reason. They do, you know, they sure. just indie games. I play a lot of indie games, and I would. You know, you, you always want to welcome that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you always, you know. Yeah, it's good to champion shit like that, right? I just hope. And I, I, I'm an Xbox guy. I always have been since, since, since Sega, Sega died. I just hope that, you know, we have a great generation. This generation with, you know, with, with the, the Xbox console and Xbox whatever in, 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 in general. But I hope, that, you know, if we when and if we get the next generation, because it doesn't guarantee they don't end up doing the same shit that Sony's doing now because that's big, you know their head's big and 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 they uh, get, they get complacent and these companies go through that shit. Bit said in the chat. <laughs> what? What's that? I'm gonna bash, bash Sony. <laughs> they need to work on their pipeline for submissions. <laughs> <laughs> Lemon, what's up, brother? Tough the man, indie man. gamer, crazy wow. Greek dude. What's good? No, I just wish it just get it just shit get. Uh, at the end of the end of the day, I don't give a fuck. You know, whatever. It is what it is. I, 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 I ain't got time to worry about it a lot, but I just wish these companies would. They quit bullshitting. That's what I said earlier. You know, you can, say, you, yeah. you can you can get more flies with uh, what's that saying? You get more flies with uh, honey, honey than you can with yeah. vinegar. Like just I said earlier. Just, just quit be, bullshitting with shit. Just be just, straight up. Just be pro consumer. Um, at, you know, make your console uh, a great value for for the gamers. And as long as you you, you you know you're not anti consumer or whatever, you're you're pro consumer. More people will want to buy in or buy your system. Period. I don't. I mean, I know these go these companies are about money, but you'll get more money if 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 you're not you know doing shady shit. You know what I'm saying? Just, I don't know. They can always yeah. do shady shit. How much are you going to accept of it? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. I mean, we all have a threshold. Is this a bad time to say I bought a PS5? Oh, yeah. Mike's here. What's happening, hey, Mike? Mike? What's up, Mike? What up, Mike? So, I've been here for like 20 minutes. I was, waiting to see, I was waiting to see how long before anybody noticed I had snuck in the room I about said, 20 minutes ago. I, 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 I saw you over there. I saw you over there. I saw you over there. Yeah, you weren't you, gonna put your disc in there anyways. Yeah, you can't blame me, Mike, because I'm playing games. <laughs> yeah, I'm, get, I'm getting my ass kicked by Alex here. Kidd. What's up, What's going on, Timmy? What's going on? See, Tim, Timmy noticed me. Yeah, I know you. <laughs> yeah, I think it's funny too. I, I, it, you would think that with all the heaven and pollen, that maybe some indie developer would kind of make Sony pay a little bit for it, but they're afraid to. Of and if course, you yes. notice, if you notice the one guy that said, you know, I'm hoping more people will come out and say something, he said, a lot of them are scared because yeah. Sony doesn't need them. And, he, nope. and they, and, and they're really, you know, it, it's really funny the, the, the shift from 2013 to now. Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah, and exactly. And that's why, you know, the, those, those indies are never going to go, none of them are going to go away, you know? I mean, like, because Sony's, you know, you don't want to lose. If you're an indie guy or indie developer, you're not going to. No, they're not going to go away, but it's going to make it harder for them to acquire new indie indie uh, indie games. You know what I'm saying? You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, Mike. I didn't mean to start talking over here. I'm sorry, dude. I do that shit. I'm sorry. No, no, it's all, it's all good, doggy. That's, that's Renegades, man. No. You gotta talk to people. Okay, well, I'm, I'm sorry. That's right, because there's I'm eight sorry. people. There's like freaking oh, ten people. Hey, by the way, I'm talking over I will say it's it's awesome to be on another podcast with your brother Mike. It is. I got. I had to put you on the spreadsheet for an appearance on NLG. Ah, oh, man. Awesome, man. I can't wait. We'll, You'll we'll, be on before yeah. me. I, I, and hey, <laughs> yeah, there you go. Dude. We can do. We'll do a marathon. Chris, you are never talk. available on Thursday night. But me and Crispy on there, we'll do well, a marathon. Well, it wasn't Thursday night to begin with. I'm just saying. 
don't know who'd oh, want to no. go on that dumb podcast it was, anyways. It was, it was Saturday. Night. Oh. <laughs> like back we've never ever, we've remember never, when next was on Saturday? Like <laughs> we've never we've never been on Saturday. They've never been on Saturday that I know of. No, no, I'm talking about next. I it wish was, next. Was, oh, I wish yeah, next was next, still yeah, on Saturday. Yeah, yeah. It'd make it easier for me to catch it, man. I, you know, I, I know he's. I know he's busy, but, but I love. I love yeah. You know. I mean, I, I I would like to catch his podcast too, but yeah, you know. it's, it's a good show. It's a good show. It is a good show. Anyway, it's a yeah. different. It's a different. Uh, it's yeah. a different audience from us, so you know. Yeah. I don't exactly. I don't consider him any kind of competition. He's just a different audience. Oh no, I would never. You so. guys. You guys probably don't yeah. think of each other's competition. Yeah, right? You guys are yeah. all like, yeah. I would. I yeah, guess, we all got. I'm, I'm sorry. I shouldn't. Yeah. This, but. Well, no. He's got a good. He's got a good thing going with the Xbox coverage and. Yeah. And that, that's a big help. So. Yeah. Well, you, I don't know. You just, I could imagine you in competition with anybody, Mike. You're such a nice, nice guy. And you, all you guys on your podcast, you guys are all so nice. Yeah, uh, HGK is a little oof, but you know. I'm afraid uh, if I come no, on there, they're, they're working with you. Hey, 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 Mike, Mike, because we're here, uh, how, how you feel about Review Tech at this point? <laughs> uh, you know what? Honestly, yeah, you can, you so, can stay so here. Hold on. Right, all right, yeah, so hold can. on. So, so hold on. So I, and I'm being. Hang on. All right, let me turn off the treadmill. Hang on a sec. Turn off the treadmill. <laughs> no, I mean, let me pause, let let me pause my treadmill. I'll be dead honest with you. I honestly don't care. And I know that sounds like, no, Mike, you really do. No, I really don't. Like, everybody else, everybody else that he took a run at was, you know, oh, I got to make a video. I got to respond. And I'm like telling these guys, guys. You are feeding him. That's what he wants. Of course. You know, we had like one dude, one dude come and come and comment on one of our videos. That's how that's how much he affected us, right? And and so I, honestly, when a man shows his ass like that, you know who he is. Thanks for I, the free publicity, I, though, right? I, I mean, even I even hit I sent Mike a text message on Friday during the day. I was like, you know, he's gonna be at that, that event you're going to, right? Just to let oh. Mike know, heads up. I like, <laughs> so he's really not, because at the end of the day, he's gonna be in a room filled with people that he bashed, and Ooh, there's, there's, there, yeah, he's like, like I won't, I won't address him on air, because he's not worth it. It's not worth the energy. No, that's that's not worth doing that. But, but if he comes and stands next to me, I'm gonna have a couple words for him. No, I was man just, to, I, I was just man giving man. you, a, I was just giving you a heads up, Mike, so you could be prepared, so you didn't run into him like, oh shit, Richie's here. Oh no, no, <laughs> he, he, he's, he's not, he's, he wouldn't come. First off, nobody wants that guy around kids. That's number one. Number Ooh. two, mm. you know, spicy. <laughs> you know, this is, this, this is, if if if, a, if somebody drops twenty bucks on the ground, he might take a shirt off. We don't want that. So, oh. uh, you know. I, if he if he showed up and I had to be in the same if I had oh, to be shit. in the same oh, you know circle yeah then man to man him and I'll have a couple of words about what he said I just but, let you I just let you know because I saw how heated that got you and I was like yeah let me just give him a heads up let me let me <laughs> let me just uh interject I, real quick because I, I I watch it and and Mike I respect you I I love you and I, I also know that you know every word you say up, is is really thought out and and also true to yourself. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. for this yeah. man to to and this is I've experienced this. Somebody trying to copy my fucking voice, okay, and trying to act like a douchebag. All right, Rich from Review, Review Tech USA can go fuck himself. Okay, after what I saw, I I unsubbed, and I, I just ridiculous. Like for somebody to be excited about gaming and you to sit there and fucking think that you are better than people, and and act like you're you're uh you're some kind of like magical god that you know I'm I I'm all that matters. You know what? Right. You might have the fucking views, but you ain't truthful. You just think it's entertaining. And guess what? At the end of the day, there's people like myself who see through that fucking bullshit. And you know what? Yep. You want to sit there on a podcast or on a live stream or whatever you want to call it and be an asshole to people 
and disrespect them, that is bullshit. Because that's exactly what he did. And go fuck himself. But you know, he, he called. Did he you notice he called it freedom? Off. He called it freedom of speech. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, called yeah, insulting people freedom ass. of speech, which is ridiculous. This is coming from the guy. Crispy who, truth going on right there. This is coming from the guy who sucks on um on cucumbers. Oh, cucumbers. <laughs> right. <laughs> and and talks to a toy chicken. Doesn't he already <laughs> fuck himself? <laughs> yeah, probably with that cucumber. Hey, he loves those cucumbers, Ooh. man. Come on. You know, you want to get oh. dirty? I mean, this is the problem I have with people like this. Y'all, you ever go on a podcast and try to talk that kind of shit? Come on, man. Like, you're going to put it live to people, and, and, and that's who they think you are? Some people are going to be definitely turned off, and that's because they see through your bullshit. Yeah, it could be funny at times, but at the same time, disrespecting people to that point Mama! is absolutely ridiculous. Mama. Mama. That's a good Mama. point, Crispy. Yeah. Crispy, man, that's... A hey, Mama Rocks. That was a good rant for the ages right there, which is, you know, yeah, the total facts, too. You know, so, I have advice as fraudish. Uh, no. If you no, no, challenge no. him to a no. boxing match. Use your regular match, voice. Use your regular voice. Use your regular voice. I, I can't use my can't, 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 You can't, can't do it. No, can't do it. Can't do it. Can't He's do become it. the character. <laughs> right, yes. Kick, kick him out, Jake. He's going to be the embodiment, all right? <laughs> as you be, peace, love, and life. What you can do is there challenge him to a boxing match, and it's legal. So whatever Ooh, happens in the boxing ring, clowns. you know, you could take him down, hold and hold you can't clowns. get in trouble. You know why Rich did that? You know, you, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to say this real fast. You know why Rich did that? Mm. Fucking clicks and ads. That's a click and ad That's, that's, that's it. exactly that's it. it. And by the way, so so let me just let me just say for the record, I love you guys. I love That's you too. I love I, you too, Mike. That is, I mean, you Mike, guys, you guys have awesome actually guy. been, you guys have actually been more amped up about this than me, and that tells me that tells me everything I need to know about why I hang with you guys. And you know what, Mike? You've handled all this back. very well too. You know what I'm saying? Like a pro, like you should. Well, because I mean, in all honesty, <laughs> that man can't touch my real life. That's right. Like, man. there no, isn't exactly. a thing. No. There isn't a thing he could do. You just don't lose your one, on any of that, and you just, you know, yeah. you stay who you are because people love yeah. you. They know that shit's full fucking shit. In in the end, I can look my kids in the eyes and right. tell them the thing that you, I mean, Yobi knows. You guys all know. My son does videos with me. My eleven year old. Yes. Yes. Because I Seth. because because he I can Seth. because I can do that. He's going with me, and I can't announce the event officially, so this is all unofficial. Tomorrow night, tomorrow night, and on, on Thursday night will be more official, but he's going with me. Nice. And he's, nice. he's, he's awesome. He's going to be involved, because I can, I can take pride in what I do. I can, at the end of the day, with my little 1,270 sub channel, I can be proud of the content that I put out. I can be proud of the people that I associate with. Mm. And I'll yeah, tell you what, right. honestly, and, I'll tell you it. what honestly got me more. What honestly got me more wasn't that he came after me. I don't. I really don't care. But he had. But he had Peter and Chris on the screen too. That angered me because yeah. those guys have nothing to do with anything other than we were covering Finnegan Fox. Mm. And what's yeah. What's kind of what's kind of hilarious is what he said didn't even match what I was saying. I was simply pointing out that the game allows you to change the 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 weather to get through objects. That's not new and revolutionary, but it's a neat mechanic. And that's so that's not even what what he was doing didn't even match what I was talking about. So, and the other thing too is, you know, people will, uh, if anything, you know, maybe a couple people do go, I, I need to check these guys out to see see how bad they really are. Then they come check us out and they go, well, wait a minute, these guys aren't bad at all. No, you, exactly. No, no, you guys, is, you, you guys is, uh, your guys' podcast is one of the most inviting, family 
family. Like it, it's so. It's like you when you tune into you guys' podcast, you feel like you're, you're watching family or your brother. Yeah, that's the so only the thing that time. I was afraid of is if I come on that show. I'm gonna slip. I'm like, there's gonna be like a cuss car. It's gonna be like a swear okay. jar, and I'm gonna right, owe so the doggy. chat like a hundred bucks. So, doggy, uh, we had we had ACS Huff gone a couple a couple weeks ago. You're good. Well, he, he don't cuss that much, right? He's not like. Well, he toned it down. Trust okay, me. Yeah. We've had I can, we've I can, had Wilmy. Wilmy has been on our show. I oh, think okay. You'll be fine. All right. So, okay, I'll be. Good. I I'll think be you'll be fine. Then. Okay. Cool. All right. So, no, I didn't you know, so. Yeah, because yeah, well, you're also. Your show is so passionate. Like, I love how passionate your show is. Everybody in that chat loves you, loves all you guys. And it is. Your show, it takes you guys like an hour and a half to get to the topics because everybody's talking about how everybody's so fired up about it, just their own thing they've thought about over the week. Or, you know, just, or, or you've yeah. got a, a cool guest on and, and, and you start talking about their life and their gaming history and shit. And then that goes off in a tangent. And of course, you got to talk about some Amico, baby! You know, you're damn so, right. Yeah. So, and then also, by the way, before... And Doggy, I forget, and Doggy, you definitely want to be in the chat this Thursday. I'll uh, be I'm there. just telling you. I'll be there. Because, be uh, unfortunately, you live too far away, but you're going to... I've already told you about it, but we're going to we're gonna talk about it on Thursday. You know what's coming. Okay. All right. Yes. I'll be I'll be there Thursday. I'm going to be there every Thursday from now on. I love your show. I, you know, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a new... A new in the chat guy, but yes, your, your, your show no, is it's very refreshing. Good. But well, also, before I, mean, I forget, I want to know one thing. I'm going to bring this up. Maybe we could talk about this if, if I come on the show someday. Hopefully. Hopefully, that'd be awesome. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. I remember saying something in the chat, and you and you answer back to it. I've, I've and, and it seems like I can't get anybody that knows this, but you seem to might have a key to this. I used to love this this uh, franchise of baseball. It was called High Heat Baseball. Yes. And it was on PlayStation, right? And then well, and then yes. And then it was on Xbox too, and it went multiplayer, yep. right? You know, once once Xbox came out, and Xbox and it was the best baseball game. It played so good, right? But Xbox bought that franchise, yeah. right? And they were going to own the it. IP. Uh -huh, yeah, and I wish they bring it back. But that's beside the point. They were going to use that to put on their XSN. I think it was called Xbox Sports XSN. Network. XSN. Yep. And nothing ever happened. And there went that great IP of a baseball game, dude. That was that was the best. That one played great. So you seem so, to know what happened there. You could either tell now or tell. Later. Oh, it's this is so. Well, I think we're <clears> far <throat> enough into the future that I don't think this is this is going to hurt anything. So. XSN Sports was, uh, 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 to me, it was one of the best cool things out there. And there was, they, they had Lynx, back. they had NFL Fever, they had NBA Inside Drive, um, no. they had Rally, Rally Sport Challenge, um, yep. was all part of that, right? Yep. Yeah. Listen to the knowledge coming out of that brain. I know, right? So, mm -hmm. remember, remember what happened e3 that year who announced they were finally joining xbox live yeah um, is it doubtfire we don't know just say it. <laughs> i don't know <laughs> it was the biggest know. it was the biggest announcement of that of that time period what year was it again hey, Ed. 20, 2003 i believe i can't remember that far Did back say it? all right I mean, beer too, to go too much back. weed since then. <laughs> that was the year. So that was the year that EA joined Xbox Live. Because remember, they didn't want to be part of Xbox Live. They didn't want to no. be shit. I don't remember this. That's why no. 2K yes. was a big thing. Yeah. Right? yeah. So and yeah, go ahead. Oh damn. Okay. That Let's year, that going. year at E3, they made the announcement, and they had a big booth up and a whole nine yards. I mean, I had. If you uh, if you go back and you look at our E3 pictures that I posted that week, I've got a picture of the booth. So EA always kind of wants to be the sports franchise on a platform because you notice. Oh yeah, yeah. That yeah. other than other than MLB the Show, there's no other sports games really coming out from nine. Well, now it's Sony Santa Monica, but was nine eight nine Sports. Yep. EA, and that's what that's what sunk, that's what sunk Sega and EA's relationship. EA went to them and said, "We want Madden to be, you know, the only football game on your platform." And they said, "Well, that's all well and good, but we just bought this 2K, you know, this uh, Visual Concepts uh, 2K game, uh, yeah, right." 
well, we own this, we own this development studio, Visual Concepts, and well, we want to put out our own games too. And EA said, fine, we'll go elsewhere. And that's why they dumped the you know, Dreamcast no for the shit. PlayStation. Because oh, if okay. you notice too, again, Sony, Sony had NCAA Game Breakers. They had NFL, um, I forgot what the, I forgot what their NFL franchise was. And they what, had, Sony? Uh, or not yep. Sony, but a Sega? Sony. Um, game Day or they, something, right? Game Day, thank you. NFL yep. Game Day, they had Gretzky NHL, and all of that disappeared. So that's what happened with Microsoft. Microsoft just said, well, yeah, we'd rather have Madden and NBA Live and all these games on our online network where everybody's going to be playing rather than our own games. And so they... They dropped their own sports series and sold. Oh, Amp Two was part of XSM Sports, so you could play freaking. No, you're right, bro. Right. So they sold off Visual Concepts to 2K, Take Two, God. which is you know, and that's that's why Microsoft dropped their sports series. And then so they just said to hell with the whole high heat baseball. Which uh, did anybody else ever play that? That was a great I did. franchise. It was uh... a great franchise. And we had heated tournaments of that game uh, back was, in the day, wasn't it? Wasn't a huge sports guy well, at, uh, it, when I was younger. It was originally owned by the 3DO company. 3DO, so yeah, first, 3DO. Yeah, yep. so the first High Heat was out on the 3DO. And yep. that's and where I they, first And then they were on PlayStations and stuff. And they always, right. you know, and then they had Kurt Schilling's on there for the longest time. And those were the best ones, the 2003 and four. And then... Bam, they were gone because they played like a dream. Like, oh, they, they were, were simple. Great. They were simple, but they played the best you could rob home runs. Just, the fielding was awesome. Just, was just give me back uh, um, NFL Fever football, and I'll buy a football mm. game again. Oh, nice. Mm. Yeah. I used to like a that... cricket game on the Mega Drive. It was quite fun. Oh, you um, could press a button I... every time you hit someone's Thanks legs and say, How's that? And it used to be so fun keep spam pressing and saying, How's that? How's that? How's that? The, the main yeah. sports. Yeah, yeah. 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 The main sports tiles of all, like really yeah, only ball, game. It's an English was, thing. was like basketball, like NBA 2K back in the day on the Dreamcast, and then yep. like uh, um, like boxing games. I mean, I, let me I, tell I, you. Oh yeah. NBA Inside Drive, which was Microsoft's basketball game at yes. the time, honestly, was Damn one of the Mike. best basketball games you could get. It they was fun as hell too. That's yep, good. And it, nice. it was easy. It was. You know, because they had the dual sticks then, so they kind of introduced the whole two stick thing. See, that's what was cool about fucking uh, earlier NBA 2Ks and shit. Yeah, the dual stick stuff. They don't do that shit anymore. Yeah. Like they're not, they don't play the same like that shit. Yeah, guys, I have and, a very fever. I have a serious okay. question to ask. I'm playing a game, and I've just been told that I have to get inside the the pedocopter. I'm a, little, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little afraid. <laughs> if it says free cookies inside, don't believe it. Free cookies inside. <laughs> and candy. Dragon oh. Heart Yobi. You guys are so freaking awesome. That's all I gotta say. You guys really are. Well, you're and awesome too, bro. It's, you, uh, man, it's so cool being on here. That's you guys don't need Yobi, part of the show. We try. You, guys yeah, you, hard tonight. you just don't eat it to yourself, brother. Yes. <laughs> Bobby, did you call me? <laughs> yeah, thanks for that. Thanks for that um inside hit that inside look at the history of that cuz I always wondered what happened to You uh, want to know the history of that. video games? You talk to Mike. He should be writing the book. Me if 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 yeah. when I'm on your show, Mike, we're going to be on there. We're going to rival the Pong Soul and the uh, <laughs> Red Pool Soul. It's on. Five hours. We're doing five and a half or All six. Right. Okay, Mike. I got a question for you. All right. Why did Why did the Why did Atari design the Jaguar controller to look to look and be so goddamn terrible? Uh -oh. <laughs> nah, nah, well, nah, yeah, they that were too. horrible. <laughs> yeah. I, I tell you to ask them, but where are they now? <laughs> Actually, Atari Atari just sent you, out man. a press release today. Saying they were refocusing on premium PCs and console games rather than the free-to-play mobile the, stuff. Yeah, and it's not so, the same, and, and it's really not the same Atari. No. That, yeah, exactly. The, v, exactly. the VCS is just Atari in name. That's it. Exactly. It's basically a little mini PC is what that is. Yeah. 
Yeah. It sounds exactly. like Atari needs to go back to the days of drinking and smoking weed and. and yeah. I know. <laughs> I, I, I Making knew. the good stuff. We're, we're I, not. We're, yeah, we're not. Yeah, we're. We've lost touch. We've I lost knew touch with when I got home and unboxed the Jaguar and plugged that bitch up. I was like, they goddamn swindled me. You fucking bastards. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? There were a couple. Dude, there were a done... couple of games. There was. A... There was. There was. Tempest. Alien versus Predator well, was I, a I masterpiece. That was damn good. And that's basically mm -hmm. that's basically the only thing I played on out of like the three or four games I bought at launch. I mean, I, I'm good. a I'm a fighting game guy, but Consuming oh, Ninja was it. Consuming Ninja was trash. It was. It was trash. It was, it was trash. So bad. So bad. I did keep the headband that it came with. <laughs> <laughs> I love fighting games, so yeah, fighting games are just shit. The, the, oh, me too. The, the so you play it. Jago. Jago, you had an OG Xbox, right? I got it sit beside me. Tell I'm me that. Fighting game tell on me the that. 64 that was quite fun. Uh, International Karate Plus? No, I think it's like Barbarian or something it's called, where you like. Bar oh, Barbarian! When, when, when you oh, killed yeah. the. When you defeat the person yes. who them and drag the body off afterwards, it was funny. Dude, if you hit, if you if you did the spin, if you did the spinning slice just right, you could decapitate the guy. I remember that game. Yeah. <laughs> and then what you just see the guy just drag awesome. the body off afterwards. <laughs> it was yes. what, what was your question, Mike? So for the OG Xbox, there's a very underrated fighting game, and I believe it's called Cop to Go. -Chi. Did you have that one? You could break limbs and whatnot in that no. game. It was pretty. Was that, a, was that a Japanese import? Nope. Nope. I don't it, think. It, no, I didn't ever. I never owned it. All right. If you can find it, get it. You could probably get it real cheap. It is one of the most underrated fighting games. What's the, what's you, the name of it? All right, hold on. It's got it's got a. The name is K A K A K A K A K A K A K A K A K A K A K that's why, I, that's why I asked you was it a Japanese import game because I have it's never not. heard of that. <laughs> it's not. What's but I tell on? you, it's an OG Xbox. Oh, okay, 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 I got gotcha. you. And and it, it so <laughs> Mortal Kombat was not the first game to show limb breaking. Neither was I mean, and I don't mean like Tekken, Tekken no, limb breaking. I'm yeah. talking, I'm talking actual showing you. You know, mangling someone. This game did it. I'm gonna have to look that up. You're gonna have to send me a send me a remind me. Send me something on Twitter. I'll send Mike, you. I'll, I'll, I'll send you. Yeah. Hey, you know what? Maybe I'll maybe I'll stream it one night. Man, yeah, I yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've yeah, always that. been infatuated with fighting games ever since Street Fighter fucking two, dude. Like, I've just always wanted to play any <laughs> fighting game. You know, I love just the side by side ones. You know, especially. You know, I mean the. The 3D ones are great, you know, but it just even the side by side ones, man, you know, that this fighting, man. Fighting game, just the fighting game genre used to be so much bigger than it is. Uh, I have, yeah, no, no. I have dude, some man, trivia. Bring us some war, you know. I, like, I have some oh. trivia from Mike. Bring it, Daddy J. I want to know if he knows this. Okay. What was the name of the fighting game on the PS1 that was banned? Battle Arena No, nope. that was the pack nope. game. Okay, I just had to, yeah. <laughs> you can't, you can't ban the packing game. No, no. Was that um, actually packed in? I never knew that actually. Even that was the packing. Okay, yep, okay. I couldn't even remember that one. If I actually um, played it. Or not. Um, what was banned? What was, was banned? banned. On the PS1. It was banned. It was on PS1 and it was banned and when oh, the... Oh, damn it. I know this. But then, well, no, I'm going to use my yeah, phone. Jay, I'm trying you to played think. it. And I did play it. it. I played it yeah, one day. Yeah, I don't remember what it's called, though. What, was it named Two Life Girl? Yeah. No, it was not. <laughs> what is it, man? What is it, man? I, yeah, I will give you. I'll, I'll give you a hint. Okay. The, yeah. the, the, the whole game took place in an insane asylum. Shit! Not the fuck of that. Not manhunt. Nope. No, not manhunt. Okay. That, that did get banned, but that know. did. You yeah. streamed it one time. I did. I played on it on Retro this. Renegades. I played on Retro Renegades. Yeah. Where, where was I at? You were here. You were here. <laughs> fuck, I don't you were just loaded. Oh, yeah, that's what it was, yeah. Mike. I had to be. <laughs> Too many natty daddies. I'm so oh. glad that I stumped Mike. Uh, yeah, and I'm not looking it up because I'm walking No, I'm not looking it up. That's so. what I'm saying. I'm not looking. My phone's on YouTube for the The time. name of the game and everyone who's watching should look this up. The game was called Thrill Kill. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I remember okay. you playing that. Yeah, I remember yeah. you playing yeah. it. Yeah. I never played never it. I never played it. Played it. But... Never played it. Yeah, I never either. played it either. Yeah. It was gruesome for its day. You know, very yeah. pixel- very pixelated, but it was like you could decapitate, 
and break limbs and they had some crazy characters in there like there was like a nurse that had um uh, had uh bladed arms and there was like a, like a, an executioner guy it had some crazy crazy characters yes yeah, so you see, get a see, chance see, see. check it Wait. out you describing that? Remember the the clay fighting game? Oh, of course, yeah. clay fighter. Yeah. Clay fighter, clay fighter two, baby. You, you, well, you judge me, clay. You describing that game, Jay, makes me think of Way of the Warrior by Naughty Dog on a 3DO. Digitized. Oh. I love that yeah. game. The, yeah. control, the, the controls were kind of janky. I had that one. But the yeah. soundtrack was fucking awesome, and it was digitized yep. characters just like Mortal Kombat. The intro sequence was amazing. It had a talking skull. Talking yeah. about the, oh man, so good. And what doesn't I had make that one too, Jago. What, like, what, the, what doesn't make sense to me is that that game, oh, Drill Kill. I've had them all, brother. It was not <laughs> as graphically violent as Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat was never banned. Maybe in some countries, but in, in the majority of countries, got, it was not banned. Yeah, was it banned not, in America, or just no? They tried. They put the ESRB. They, they were formed. Zelda the was midway. Yeah. I was just yeah. watching some of that video from Thrill Kill, and man, that game does look pretty good. Yeah. What's that? What what game? What'd you say, bro? Thrill Kill. Thrill Kill? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, doggy. I've had every console just about known the man at one time. I've, or I've about had them all. Except the Switch. Except the Switch. Had... But that, there's, a different, there's a difference there. I don't want I that didn't, trash. I didn't ever have <laughs> a Jaguar. We consoles on handhelds. <laughs> I didn't have a Jaguar. I didn't have one of those virtual I, You know, I never had a, a Saturn. And that's, my biggest regret is never owning a Saturn. Oh, I, I still have a Saturn, Saturn. And I got that, like, the date. Like, almost the day it came out, dude. I remember if, like, if you had it early enough, they sent you, like, a, a free update of the Virtual Fighter. It was called Virtual Fighter Remix. Dude, I was so... My, so, Saturn, like, my, was, my, my Saturn, I got cheaper than anybody else in the entire place. You had the five-finger so. discount. Y yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn! Shit! I didn't yeah. say I'm good. Satchel Tate has been running out on that. I, 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 yeah, 20 I years ago. The Saturn was a funny console because I just went to, uh, I don't remember if it was Best Buy or somewhere, and they it just was there. One day, and I was like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, they, dro they, dro <laughs> dropped it e they dropped it at E3. Jeepers! Here, it's ready to go. Go, yeah. get it out. I think I got <laughs> lined like, up. Where did this come from? <laughs> uh, be, be careful! Be careful what you say about Saturn now. I think I got oh, no, lined no, no, no. in a KB Toy Store. Hey, yeah. oh, no, hey, guys, you did not that? get it. Hey, you guys remember that chain? Yeah, oh, yeah. They were fused. Yeah, they refused. It might be Sega CD. It might, yeah, it was either the Saturn. Yeah, or they refused. Yeah. They refused to sell the Saturn. Okay, so it was the Sega CD. I got a KB toy. It probably sold like shit. I was probably the only person that bought one. I had a Sega CD. I had a Sega CD. I had a Sega CD. I had one of the first ones too. It came with like gold keys. And it came with like fucking. Yeah, it came with like. It came with like Sherlock Holmes and fucking. Hey, doggy. Sewer Shark was fun as hell on the Sega CD. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they were fun. Dude, I still play them. Come on, dog me. Do you have? I still play that game. Do you oh, have no, no, the no, Adventures no. of Wooly Beamish? Yeah, I do. Oh, I love that game. That game is I so love... good. Time yeah. Gal, Time Gal, uh, Time Gal, Road Dragon Avenger, Dragon, Dragon Slayer, uh, Dragon Slayer, Night Road Night, Avenger, Night Trap, Night Trap, yeah. Night Trap. Runners they don't wear ties. Double switch. Full motion yeah, video. Double switch shit. with Corey Haim. I'll <laughs> tell you what, the best, the best of the full motion video games though, besides Sewer Shark, was Ground Zero Texas. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That oh, game was fantastic. Yeah. With the nice. aliens. Yep, and you're in you're in like this wild yeah, west town. Yeah. <laughs> I, I actually got that. that. Do I have that? Which one do I have? I've got that one on Sega CD. And I got Corpse Killer on Corpse the Saturn. Corpse Killer, nice. Doomsayers, Axel, what's up, my brothers? Good what's going hey, on, guys? Hey. What's up, Doomsayers? Nice Thanks to see a large chat by. room. Sorry, guys. I I'm know what a great. Not able to. What not able to chat test. tonight, guys, but. I will say I, I, I will say one thing, Mike. Slayer Axel, the the, the Dreamcast is better than the Saturn. See, okay. Oh Here's, yeah. So <laughs> you guys have to understand. You guys have to understand why I didn't get the Saturn because I was already into PC gaming at the time, right? You dork. And Fair. and I and I love PC gaming, and I thought you know the Saturn doesn't look any better than my PC. But then when I saw the Dreamcast, then I was like, holy shit, we finally surpassed PC quality yep. graphics. Yeah. Well, that's because you got arcade, Dreamcast. you got arcade quality graphics because yeah. they were using that board in their arcade games at that time. 
Hey, well, hey, yeah. hey, yeah. Jay. Yeah. Who, who, who did that for you? Yeah, exactly. Xbox and Microsoft. That's right. <laughs> well, come on, who didn't love Virtua Cop at the time? Well, yeah. Virtua, I loved yeah. all those nice. on rail yeah. shooters. I loved them all. Yeah. 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 I played them all on PC. How, all those. How, how, how how the house of the Dead. Dude, I just had a CD. Yeah. yeah. On the Sega CD, I had Lethal Enforcers with the with the two guns. Oh, yes. yeah. The blue ones. Oh, man. That's a good yeah, one. Blue. Oh. One was blue, one was uh, pink. Orange! Yeah. yeah. Or orange. Well, no, I don't know if my... No, it was I, pink. It was pink. Yeah, I got to Because I still have them. Oh, shit. Well, okay. Well, they're it's probably orange. The only now. guns I picked up was PS1 <laughs> for... Well, I didn't have them. I didn't well, have them. So one, of, Area 51. one of Mike's favorite games, uh, Jet Grind Radio for Jet Set Radio. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. No, oh, the yeah. The was one of my favorite consoles. Yes. Of all time. See, I knew I this was my console. Oh, I never owned. owned. How many of you guys ever owned the Power Glove? How many of you guys ever owned it and took it back? Of course. I never. Uh, I, I, I never took it back. Had the Power Mac. By, by, the, by the time, by, by the time I got an NES, they didn't make it anymore, dog. Yeah, well, yeah. There you go. See, I <laughs> yeah, missed I was... up. Yeah, I got one at our Kmart, right? That thing was the biggest <laughs> piece of fucking shit. <laughs> and yeah, I, you talk I about the Nintendo Switch stick drift. This was this. You know what? You, what you, what'd you say? If I'm sorry. Oh, I had Rob the that that robot. Rob the robot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He was only good for like two games. Damn, yeah, infinite. No, the only the what? only time well, the only one game the game became with it. The only time the power glove oh, actually worked. About that. The only time the power glove actually worked as advertised was when it was in the that that Fred uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. The wizard. Yeah. The wizard. <laughs> the wizard. Yeah. Right. Hey guys, I'll admit I just watched that movie the other day, dude. I <laughs> man, I loved that movie when I was, when I was a kid, dude. And it was on sale on Xbox like. A couple like weeks ago, shit, and I just got around to watch it. That movie's cool. Like in the, in the so kid went to the to the championships, California. I don't know if you guys. I, I don't know if you guys ever played Sword of Berserk Guts Raid. Right? Oh, I love oh, that yeah. game. It was fucking awesome too. That's that. That was fucking. And awesome. Mocking X, which was kind of in that realm. Yep. Yep. Damn. Yes. Man, he's just, yes. He's yes. Now, to be fair, the Genesis did have the activator. So they didn't oh they were immune. Oh, yeah. they were yeah. immune yeah. to their pieces Son of shit of hardware. No, no, they won't. Bitch. No, they won't. That thing was horrendous. <laughs> yeah. The activator. It was a, it was that octagon you stand inside you could control use your yeah. body to control. <laughs> <laughs> now they just, didn't, yeah, now they just need to come out with well, wait you know, a minute. accessory didn't called the, the masturbator. Have, have, masturbator. The masturbator. Have VR, not VR, but like uh, 3D glasses. The 3D master glasses, system has 3D glasses. glasses. I had those. Glasses. Yeah, what? Yeah. That they worked. worked. They did work. They worked. They worked <laughs> like a fucking dream, dude. They were amazing. For what that was time, this? What was this? Eight, on the 8 bit Sega Master, they yeah. had 3D glasses. Remember when? I remember when I rented Rad Racer on the NES, never, and it came with fucking that. the 3D glasses, the red it and the blue worked. 3D glasses. No, 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 yeah, I know. But these no, were this these were like the heads that you put on. No, 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 I'm sure the, that was different. Yeah, I don't remember that. But the yeah. Master System 3D glasses were those shutter type glasses. Yeah. That, oh, that okay. Plug, yeah. And you plugged it into the system. Yep. And that's why it worked so well. I mean, it really one. worked. It did. It really did work. I was blown away with the first. I can't remember the game. There was some kind of missile game that came straight at your face. Yeah. Yep. And you got to shoot them. Man, I was like, missile holy fake, shit. Missile game going right at your face. You sure you weren't watching porn? <laughs> <laughs> not, at, not at uh 10 or 11. <laughs> wait, wait a second. You're a late bloomer? <laughs> You're a late bloomer. I was a late bloomer <laughs> to porn, yes. I'm gonna, was it cool, was it cool lady drop weapon? out, guys. <laughs> hey, have a good one, Clown. Have a good one, Clown. Uh, all right, Clown. Nice. Love you, brother. brother. Take it easy. We'll see you, see you Thursday uh, early evening. Yep. Yep. Clowns. Is it ever early for you, Mike? Like, you seem to always be late on the Late Pet Cop podcast. Oh, he's you are the, you are the ever, master man. of the Jesus clowns. He, wait, he, I used to think, I, I used I don't to think he was on the West podcast, Coast. His podcast because just, he was always, went to one o'clock. I was like, this guy has to be on the West Coast. Nah, he just, he has Mike, to you're, you're just, you got the energy, bro. <laughs> you are the man. I've got a good job that allows me to sleep till 30. Oh, okay. Well, you know. You're the well, man. Da. Dude, when you're in, yeah. when you're in, oh, I, when you're in <laughs> IT, when you're in IT, you can take meetings from your bed. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> that's awesome. Kick, kick Ross, Mike. <laughs> that sounds that sounds awfully bougie to me. <laughs> <laughs> Call it what you will. <laughs> <laughs> He's in his morning woods to prop up the laptop. 
<laughs> no, 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 no. Why, no it's it's, it's, it's yeah. got to have, it's got to have some kind of use. Who well, well, haven't we said hello to in the chat, guys? I see Axel. Listen, we Mike, say hi to Mike, Axel. Mike, 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 don't tell anybody. And, and when he does it, he uses his eye pood. Right? Eye pood. Don't tell anybody. And when he does it, he uses his eye pood. Mama. I hear an echo. Yeah, I do too. Mama. Somebody's That's my fault. Somebody's volume is up or something. That's my fault. Mama. I was checking Mama. the chat on another screen and it was. It was I just put I just put the Sega uh, the Sega Master System 3D glasses in the Retro Renegades. Yeah, nice. Right, check that. I put that Sega Activator commercial on there. They actually look like sunglasses. What's up, PK? Yeah, bro. Yeah, that's cool. experience. Up, either one of PK, those. PK, what's either happening, PK? Right. PK, I, I you're had late. Them, man. They're working. What's up, brother? Yeah, did retro, did retro bro come into the chat? I don't see nope. him. No. No. Okay. Not yet. Did everyone right, say if... say hi to Mesuko? PK. Mesuko. Yeah, clowns mentioned earlier about on uh, celebrity yeah, boxing with um Tech. And I was like, out why, yeah. why would I be celebrity boss when I could just beat him up? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so, so, one hundred dollars for the best free. podcast you know, out like, here. For what? What yeah. would, what, what would I get out of that? Nothing. You know who would benefit from that? Rich. Him, because he's a drama yeah. queen. Yeah. So yeah, I wouldn't I, benefit I, from I, that. I'd be listen. I, I, I will beat him up for free. Have someone videotape and send the footage to him so he got let on his on his channel. I would simply all I would really do, honestly. Is I'm gonna have that clip on my phone, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna say, "Hey, Rich, I'm uh, Mike Mullis from Next Level Gaming. Uh, like, hey, who this is you, right? This is you." And I'll play the clip, and I'll say, "Now, Come we're here, man. The man, why don't you why don't you talk Catch to me, me outside? Now? Why don't you talk to me now? <laughs> and tell me tell me how you feel now. Catch and, me and outside. You know how about that?" <laughs> I tell you that that guy would turn around and go, "Hey man, I didn't mean anything." Oh, of, course. of course, of course. Hey, because that's what bullies do. Bullies are usually cowards. Yeah. Mike, what? can I tell you something, Mike? One hundred. Yeah. Intro Media Gaming says one of the best podcasts out here. I gotta give that's you one fact. of these. Oh hell yeah! That's a fact. Thank hey, you, listen. Bear. Don't say that, Daddy J doesn't like you calling it a podcast. Wait, Mike, can yeah, you hear me? It's a fun cast. I, I got you. I got you, brother Yobi. So, so it's a retro gaming show. He, so, 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 this is what people do. They they talk all this shit online, but sooner or later, once E three comes back and we all see see each other in person, the, the energy is gonna change. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. What Never about fails. having the online persona. Never fails. Exactly. And that's that's what I love about all you guys, and that's why I fit in, because we are all the same. Whether there, we're here there, or not, there, you're real. You're real, no, man. There, there is no persona. I am who I am, and that's all well, that exactly. I am. Exactly. Everybody <laughs> here is real about shit, We're man. Genuine and a proper self. Genuine. There's every a one, one of you guys has exactly. talked to me. Has talked to me offline. Jago has talked to me on the phone. Yobi has talked to me in a stream. Jay talks to me all the Jago time. Jago talked to you on the phone. Jago, you lucky bastard. Yeah, I've called him. I've called hey, him hey, Mike. I'm just Mike. I'm so busy, man. It's hard for me to get a chance to fucking like do anything. Yeah, <laughs> you know, whatever. Mike, Mike I got to phone pick with you though, Mike. I, I, I added you on Xbox, and you did not add me back. I can tell you, Mike. Will, you, oh, right, so to be fair, what's up, bad shit? Huh? To be fair, he's got your block. I haven't played. I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just right, saying, so, bro. Hey, add me so, up. We, we, we play some. To, to be fair, it talking to party. I have been. I have been on my. I have been playing on the PS5 the last few days. That's all right. Hey, cool. What you been playing, bro? So the only thing that I really could right. play, which is Astro's Playroom. Retro. Right, right. No old games. Play that much. Well, so, and and I wanted Let's... to hook the PSVR up to it, and then I realized I've got the first edition PSVR helmet that doesn't do HDR. Sorry. So, that's so, that's but it still works. Does it still work? It, it works, but but it won't pass the HDR signal, which means I it's lose that enough. feature means no 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 to mike i'll be honest with you hdr is more noticeable than resolution i mean honestly 
Oh, I love my HDR on this this TV. I got it's fucking yeah. Yeah. yeah so uh, so I, I can imagine it in a headset in a, in a in a fucking V uh the fucking VR set. I bet you. It, yeah, I bet you that would be. You gotta get well, back no, to but but that's just it. Even without the headset, having the because the, the box plugs into the PS5, and then the other side plugs into the TV. So while that's there, you don't get HDR even even straight to the TV. There's no pass through. Yeah. So I lose that feature altogether. Yeah, you don't get no HDR whatsoever. I got, so I, got I got the same one, Mike, and I couldn't use my PSVR on a P when I get my PS5 anyway because they never sent me that fucking adapter, even though I signed up for it. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Diego, do you have a, a, a quest yet? Yes, I do. Oculus yes. Quest Two. No, it's, well, it's, the, it's yeah, the first one. I do. Well, my son's got the two. I finally got a chance to try it out. Jay has the two. I have I the two. Love it. Dude, love Vader and what? The one is just as good. The one is just as good. Doesn't have the higher refresh. Yeah, yeah. 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 the one's good. I don't need the two. Yeah, I don't. Oh. I said to the mood. I I don't need the two as little as I play the one. So. <laughs> what? what the VR? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I've played Vader a while. Is, I Vader is great. Well, wait great. till they, you know, wait till they fucking, you know, wait till they got a bunch more, bunch more for it. Yeah, I'm waiting. I'm they waiting. already got a shit ton of games for it. You just gotta find the right ones. I, I have. To, I okay. Have, All right. See, I'm. I, I, okay. I have trouble yeah. fucking gaming on a regular Xbox, so <laughs> with my time. No, there's there's some. Great yeah. See, games right, Jago. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah. yeah. There's some yeah, great it, games. I'm sure. Dude, yeah. I'm sure. If there anyone is. has played Mass Effect on on the Series S or X, bro, the low times are literally between zero and like two seconds per stage. It don't matter. It don't. It doesn't matter uh, when you play that game because uh, any way you play that game is awesome. No, the, the low no, times are crazy. You know I mean? Yes. There you go. I just, just... I, Gentlemen, I'm... um, I just wanna throw this out here. I I have to go. I got a I got a lot of shit. I got a lot of shit to deal with before we go camping for four and a half days you're so, all good bro uh, like, everything else like, good where are you going we're, good. Uh, we're going like uh it's like the new york vermont border um nice. there's like a it's it's gonna it we have to prep a it lot because we have to prep a lot because there's no shower there's there's oh a out house no, uh, no, I'm used no, no shower. Shit I, I, I can hit that that's, that. that. yeah, that's gross that's just also, crazy. i go glamping i go also, hey is it in the mountains and stuff that sounds mountainous you know it's well it's it's about it's about you 20 or 30 back. minutes away from like you go wild camping as they yeah, yeah, yeah that's what yeah. we do that's what so, we do with scouts so yeah primitive um, camping Baby got, got plenty baby to do wipes. right now, and I I gotta go because it's literally I have tomorrow after, and that's it, and we gotta right. get everything ready. So I love you guys. Yeah, Chris, I, I, I love you, brother. Have a great you later, guys bro. Have a great Chris. night, and beer on, <laughs> my friends. Beer on, yeah. 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 Be good, brother. Chris, Hi, Chris, real quick, later. hey, crispy. Yeah, crispy. Real talk, man. Like a brother, you uh. You're one of the goods, man. I love you. Thank you, bro. He knows he's one of the too, goods, Christy. man. I and I hope we Christy. all meet one day. I'm dead serious on that. Oh, we I, will. I, sure. That's going to happen. I don't care that's how gonna it's going to happen. We're, we got to make it happen. You'll you know what I mean? Fast. That's, that's going to happen. We'll get there. <laughs> but you guys have a great night. Uh, hey, shout hey, out to the person, chat that showed up. Enjoy, Thank enjoy you guys. your trip. Yeah. Enjoy your trip, Crispy, man. Have fun. Yeah, Later, have a great time, brother. Later, Crispy. Later, Crispy. Good man right there. That's a good fucking man. good man right there. That is. Oh, yes. Yep. I mean, I didn't even. Like, it's just funny. I was telling my buddy John. I said, "Dude, I didn't even bring it up," and Crispy went off. <laughs> oh, I love listening to his. I love listening to his rants. Dude, like, he, that, dude, he's so awesome, dude. I, I really, dude, that guy's that guy just he's he's so awesome, dude. I, I, he is. I would, and I he's down to earth, and and, and he's oh, go ahead. and I, real. I, I would have yes. went off, but yes, I, yes. I'm tired and I don't have enough beers yet. Give me a couple ah. of beers. <laughs> okay, well, Jago! How many natty daddies do you have? All right, here. I just one. I only drink one. The one. You need right. a shotgun in those, Jago. And, well, after that, I, I, after that hey, I, got, I got light Jago. beer. Jago, hey, Jago. Yeah, yeah. Let's have a chugging contest. All right, here, let's go. Chug, uh, chug, no. chug, oh, chug, no. 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 chug, 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 Look, look, I know people may look down on beer, like, you know, you know wine drinkers and probably liquor drinkers. Well, I'll drink wine. I'll, 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 I'll drink wine. I'll chug wine. Dude, I'm not on the. I'll do this. 
I got I, whatever. I, I, Who the I, fuck I, looks down on beer? I, I don't know. I'm just I'm just saying if there is. I like Damn! Damn! I don't I don't I don't drink it like I'm 20 anymore. He's saying Yeah, I remember we used to have a beer bong, dude. It would hold like it was like this fucking big old 10 gallon funnel, and we dumped like fucking three beers in it, tipped that fucker, dude, it just oh yeah, I, I, I would throw up if I did that now. You don't like, do I mean, keg stands anymore? Fuck no. Oh, no. fuck. Yeah, I say that foam. I would throw up, dude. Like, it would, uh, yeah. So, but I, but I'll chug a so can of beer. Cool. I'll chug a can of beer or whatever. I like to enjoy yeah. each beer, you know, at a nice, normal pace. <laughs> We're adults. Yeah. We, we drink beer for the taste. The taste. Uh, well, the first couple, and then after that, you can't taste it. <laughs> yeah, you taste much. Like Steve, I'm already past the taste and point. And, and, a, a and it's triple still dead with a smooth outcome. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. It also depends test. how cheap the beer is if you're drinking for the taste. Holy shit, back's in here. Back. Oh, back. Uh, What's happening, back? back? Back. What's up, brother? Man, that's cool, man. What's up? Doing pretty good. Yeah, What's, What's up, up brother? Back. back? Man, it's cool to be on a podcast. That's what's great about this show right here, man. You can come on here with all these cool ass motherfucker ass. Jay oh, keeps man. that back door open for everybody. <laughs> that's, that's right. Yeah, he doesn't care. He doesn't care right. who comes in. <laughs> that, 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 that sounded wrong. We're gonna have a couple. Yeah. We're gonna have a couple like goats and sheep hey, on what, here. What, what, what really happens is the door's always there, and it has this like slide. You have to open up the sliding door, <laughs> slide in the beer, and then they open the door for you. Oh, okay. That's yeah, how you yeah. get in. You gotta pay, pay, pay. What, what he said? Pause. 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 You gotta spit on the back door first. Ooh. JJ forgot to say that. Spit on the back door. <laughs> that sounds like wrong. Some Vaseline yeah, and coconut butter oils. <laughs> <laughs> That's and then, interesting. And then, and then you gotta say, like, yeah, like that. And then, exactly. you know, <laughs> Infinite always comes in with his low hanging fruit. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that that hanging fruit now hits his taint, all right? <laughs> Midway! Midway Moss is in the chat. What's up, brother? Man, what a good chat we've had tonight, oh, man. We, what we awesome have. Chat, man. We have, we have a good chat. Yeah, bud. What's up? Yeah, I'm good. It's 8.20. I'm going. See, so I turn, it's before like before that out. So I turned it. Hang on a sec. Oh, my daughter would love to come on YouTube and just say one thing, dude. She'd, she'd probably die. <laughs> what are we playing now, Jay? Who's playing the original? We're playing Alex Kidd oh, in right. Shinobi World. Oh, okay. I didn't know. Shinobi. Shinobi? Shinobi. Shinobi. She, never, she doesn't know me. I never met that she lady. She doesn't know me. <laughs> that she that don't lady's know me, baby is not. A... I am not that baby's daddy baby. So check this out, guys. I bought, I don't know if you saw my tweet, I bought, uh, I finally collected Gears 4 and 5. I've got them all Disney, but I finally collected them physically. So I'd have my whole collection, you know, I got a physical collection of all the Gears games. Except for tactics, right. I don't give a shit about that game. Right. Um, I bought Werewolf the Apocalypse, Third Blood. Physical. For, it five, not... for five bucks, I hope. No, I didn't. No, it wasn't five bucks. Um, but I still bought it because I'm like, oh, fuck, I'll go through it. Um, it would not load. You would hear the disc spin up and then stop. Spin up, stop. Spin here's, up, stop. here's five. No, Werewolf the Apocalypse. So, oh, I took, okay, so, yeah. so I took it back and I said, "Dude, this is this is defective." They said the next game stop, which is like five minutes, five minutes down the street. It's like they got one. I said, "Cool." I went and picked it up yesterday. Get it home. Put it in the Xbox. This different copy did the same damn thing. Will not load. I've never I've never had a physical game do that. Then I so slap in. Then slap in Mass Effect, loads up, put in Avengers, loads up, put in... So what Xbox didn't tell you is that game is not high enough quality to play it must not. System. It must not be worthy. Yeah, it must not so meet our, not, meet I, our I, quality I requirements. But, but the, game, the game's out bad, that's what the distant work. <laughs> I guess, I don't know, but I ended up taking it back today, and I just bought it digitally. I'm like, fuck it, I'll buy it digitally. <laughs> and I got it cheaper. Actually, I got it cheaper. <laughs> Oh, that's hard. rare. Usually, it's uh, the other way. The other around. way around. I know. That's why. That's why I say that. It's unusual. Um, yeah, the digital copy works fine. And, but and I've never, I've never had a disc do that. Two, two different discs of the same game will not load up for shit. So I got, I got a sad story for you. I have a disc for Chronicles of Riddick, um, not the second ver, the second one, um, not Butcher Bay, but uh, 
I'm gonna play it anyway. Tonight. So the second game came with Butcher Bay um, remake on it. Well, yeah. it wasn't a remake, but it was like the OG Xbox version. My disc does not play anymore in my machine. And I'm so oh. sad. I'm, I wish I could buy a digital version. I've had a hard time finding the digital version of it. No, I the only reason I, the only reason I, I bought it or, or you know, really, you bought it digital, because I have, I talked to a few people, like more than one person that said it wasn't that bad. It was actually decent. So I was like, yeah, you know, and you got to give a game a chance. And I haven't even had a chance to play it yet, but it looked, it looked kind of cool. You know, you get tired of the same old monsters. Uh, you know, it's like, fuck, who don't like werewolves? So. Going it. I don't know. I, Pe- people people seem to have weird standards these days. I heard that they're coming out with a new uh, Chronicles of Riddick game. Oh, really? I would yeah. love that. That's what I heard. I Midway, can't say I have any of them. Midway, uh, he, Midway says it's a conspiracy to buy digital. I wouldn't doubt it, at least for that game. I don't know. What mm-hmm. the fuck? I've never run into that, ever. The crazy It's going to be called Chronicles of Riddick Family Matters. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now I hear the the, the, the theme song, the Family Matters. On, oh, Jay. shit. Nah, you know, <laughs> let's not get that bullshit. Okay. Uh, yeah, we don't need any. Hey, that's one I was going to ask. Hey, there's a good one for everybody. If you was like a fighter in the UFC, you're like a, a wrestler or a fucking boxer, what would be your walkout song? Like, it'd be a video oh, game God. song. Or a uh, metal song, or a I know rock what my song, song would be song? right now. What is that? What you got? My song would be um, "Spit Out the Bone" by Metallica. <laughs> all right, all right. Mine, mine would be "Killing in the Name of" by um, uh, fuck, uh, Jesus. Rage, Rage Against, against the Machine. Rage Against, against the Machine. machine. Yeah. yeah. What about the Slipknot song? Fuck it all. Fuck this place. Fuck it. What just stands for? <laughs> <laughs> I would, I would do that uh, song by RuPaul. Sissy the Walk. Bacon ice cream production. Of course it would be. What is up? <laughs> no, we'll Everybody got real quiet. So I actually did that. You know on yeah. the original yeah, Xbox that's where right, you dude. could have your own music on the original Xbox. Mama. I put that Slipknot yeah. song as an entrance tune for my created wrestler on the wrestling right. game on the original Xbox. Uh, Did they Raw 2? Tell my Raw 2. I think so, yeah. It, it was Raw yeah. 2. It was Raw 2. Bacon ice cream productions in the chat. Hey, hey, bacon ice cream happening? Fish. Bacon ice cream, or should my I say, song, thumbs, thumbs in be, the ice cream um, sundae. My walk out song would be "Where Do I Hide" thumbs by Nick. What? What'd yeah. you say? What? would you say for your I, song I, to be? I love my, his logo. My walk out song would be "Where Do I Hide" by Nickelback. I love that song. <laughs> All right. Yeah. It, that shit rocks. I can't believe you would use Nickelback for anything. Shut the fuck you up. Can, you <laughs> guys have to stop giving Nickelback such a bad name. Nickelback is not a bad game. They're not a bad band. They're just. I saw. You know what? I make fun of Nickelback, but actually, I saw them in concert. They were actually fucking really good. And you know what's great about Nickelback? And a lot of people don't understand this, and I've said this before. They were highly inspired by Metallica. Like, if you look at the way Chad Kruger plays his guitar, he plays it like James Hetfield. They play a really good show. They, I, I made fun of it up to. I, I saw them in a show one time in Indianapolis. Dude, they were really fucking good. But. But here's a good joke, if you never heard the joke before. If a tree falls in the forest and nobody is around to hear it, well, that's a good place for a Nickelback concert. Dude. Oh, if it, no, I'm just joking. But I'm just anyway. Oh, uh, you listen, know, but, listen to Nickelback album called I'm just joking. I, I, like I said, I went to a Nickelback concert. They really do put on a good show. I've been, in, I've been, in, I've been con- to listen, several. And the, you know what? You know how people show. say people say to Nickelback that they sold out? You know what they say to them, those people? Yeah, they we sell, sell out every, every show time. Every yep. show. Yeah, they... No, they put on a good show. <laughs> I, had, I, had, I, had, I had a Nickelback CD from one of the, one of the early 2000 ones. I don't remember. Maybe... Mm. I don't remember uh, which one it was, but it was actually pretty pretty good damn CD. I ain't, I'm not going to lie. Oh, there's, yeah. A, yeah, there's probably six or seven hits off that probably whatever that cd exactly. that was i mean the guys yeah. put yeah. out yeah. hit yeah. after hit and you and you know i spent a lot of time making fun of them i went to a show and i was like damn okay these guys sing all this okay yeah okay you can make fun of that shit but i mean that show was cool and then they started like playing covers of other yeah. bands and shit and they kicked ass like and it was they, cool. they actually did a metallica like, they did like yeah, they did one a time. metallica and shit yeah they did yeah. all kinds of different bands so i was like damn these guys really 
yeah. know how to play. Like a, you know, a lot of people don't realize. Have an album realize. called "Civil Side Up." It's amazing. They even have a song dedicated to Dimebag Daryl, who was the <laughs> guitarist for Pantera, yeah. who was gunned down on stage. It, it, it's called "Side of a Bullet." Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. May, 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 may Monster put it, just put it in chat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah, like, side of a bull. I remember I, I heard it You know what? People can make fun of them all they want. The See, that there's the thing. Meg, Meg knows because he's Canadian as well. That, you know, the band gets a bad rap. They really do get a bad rap. It, is Nickelback Canadian? Well, you got to hate on stuff yes. that, that gets famous. I, you know, I, like I, the I, Patriots. I, you know, I, I, good. I, I, that explains so much. Time, you know? I, I, I had heard they were Canadian. I didn't know, though. <laughs> yeah, I thought they were Canadian. <laughs> they, they, they are good. Joke about them. They, they are suck good. so bad, they're Canadian. Uh, I remember a song, um, what was it? Well, at least there's like an Animals or something like that. Something to do with, no. the, like, something like Animals or something. But you know how you know how it is when something when something's cool to pick on? And people just exactly. continue to do it. That's it, all exactly. that is. Exactly. Yeah. And that's what I was saying. I was cool to, for me to pick on. I go check out the show. They were there with uh, like Breaking Benjamin and um. Breaking Benjamin. Great, yeah, man. they were yeah. good too. Yeah. And yeah. um, some I, I can't even remember the other band before, but they were good. Types. I just can't remember what it was. And it was a fucking awesome killer show. Damn I mean, right. Yeah. Yeah, Breaking Benjamin's really good. I like those. Well, uh, yeah, yeah, they're, yeah, they're, they're good. They're good too. Yep. So yeah. Yeah, Nickelback, yeah, they're easy to make fun of, easy target, but that's only because they are good and they, they're good at what they do. And, you know, yeah, of course, you know, you know, yeah. it's like, you know, I mean, it's easy to make fun of the boy bands back in the day, but they made money. You know, I mean, whether or yeah. not we make fun of or not, it listen to our shit. Actually, they I made, used to, you know, I, they made I, money. even to this day, I don't have a lot of respect for boy bands because I have more respect for a band that that started off in like in the bottom and then and built their way up whereas boy bands they're already started at the top because they're built by yeah, they record were. companies yeah, yeah. oh you know right. what you know That's what the, point. the, the point. album the album i had was the one with uh side of a bullet on it, it the out nickelback yeah. album i had was all the right reasons from 2005 yep all yeah. the right reasons yeah, that album as well but yeah. i remember i heard that song on serious i had a serious radio back then and shit you know and i remember hearing that song and i was like damn this is fucking and good it's heavy you know, like because i think dying yeah, bag I think Dimebag actually, um, they use riffs from Dimebag's... Uh, yeah, I think they did, too. Yeah, I th yeah, yeah. I, from, you're from right. From his collection I, or something, or old riffs that he had played. But seriously, yeah. like, the like band is not a bad band. I don't care what no, anyone says. No, no, honestly, that album almost... You know, what, you, know, you, know how you buy an album... You know how you buy yeah. that, buy, used to buy an album back in the day, and, like, one or two songs would be great, and the rest yeah. of the album sucked ass? Yeah. That, <laughs> album, that, <laughs> that album right there, like, 90% of the songs were fucking kick-ass. Yeah. Yeah, kind of like but, Alice in Chains. They yeah. never made no, a bad but song. Alice in Chains. They oh, never I, made a bad song. No, no, they made no, a bad, bad album. No, even when they got a new singer, they weren't bad. No. Yeah, even yeah, the new singer were bad, but man, when they had Lane, oh, Jerry, Jerry yeah. together, yeah. Well, Jerry's still there. They never made nothing bad. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, he's still there. I'm just saying when, yeah, and they're still great. I'm yeah, exactly. But I'm just if, saying if they never at, made bad songs. They if just, you look, if you look at my playlist I listed during the day, it's Pantera, it's it, it's uh, it's Alice in Chains, yeah. it, it, it's uh, it, uh, it's Bloodhound Gang was another band Don't that didn't make bad songs. Up. Stone Temple Pilots, mm. baby. Stone Temple Pilots. Oh my no. God, yes. 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 Uh, it's stuff like that. If you think uh, about it, guys, if you think about it, the only band that exists today that were like. Formed during the grunge days in the nineties, the only band that's left is um, oh shit. What's what, you know um, Pearl Jam. Pearl Jam's Pearl the only one left yeah. that doesn't yeah. have anyone death that has ne not not yeah, anyone died. Yeah, Poo Fighters. Poo Fighters. Oh, Poo hey, Temple of, Temple of the Dog. You, you remember that? You remember that? Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 That, that was uh, what was it? Uh, it was Pearl Jam and Soundgarden together. Soundgarden, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I love yeah, uh, that album. Uh, um, um, what was it? Yeah. She's going hungry. <laughs> I'm going hungry. I'm going hungry. <laughs> 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 okay, I, I, I have I have a weird story about that. So I used to date this girl, and she was more into pop stuff, and oh, I kind of got her into more heavy stuff with that band. You know, Temple, Temple of the Dog. Temple of the Dog. I kind of got nice. her introduced to some heavier stuff, and I was so glad that she started liking it. And then I think to this, like we, you know, of course, we don't keep in touch anymore. That was 
20, 20 some years ago. But I think not. she I think she became a metalhead after that. Hey, you know one thing? That, like one of my favorite bands from Soundgarden back in the day was uh, Rusty Cage. I love that damn oh, song. Yeah. This day. Call me song. Uh, call, call me shocked as hell when I found out that was an original Johnny Cash song. I was like, what? <laughs> Remember Johnny Ka- Johnny Cash was has a lot of people like um, doing his covers like Nine Inch Nails. Yeah. Done Johnny Cash. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, no, that's that's originally a Nine Inch Nails song. Yeah, that's no. originally a Nine Inch Nails song. What yeah, he covered? Yeah. Dude, yeah. Dude, Are you serious? Yeah, Johnny Cash. I thought Johnny Cash. Oh, so no, I. Wait, what, song? Cash what, song? what song? What song? What song? Hurt. 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 Yeah. Yeah. I could have yeah. swore that that's was a Johnny Cash song. Not Nine Inch Nails. Anybody ever heard of a band called Downstate? No, Downstate. No. Oh, don't think tell so. us more. Tell us more. Yo, they have an album called "With You in Mind." It's, they released it in 2013. Dudes Doom, are fucking sick. Doom, Listen to that shit. Doomsayers Network said, "Sing it, Jake." <laughs> <laughs> no. Remember, remember Faith No More. Fuck yeah! Uh, listen, oh, I yeah. saw Faith No More about five years ago. They played in Toronto. They're still around. Yeah, How they just reformed. Around? We I should have I... a skit on this show where everybody yeah, takes a turn you, playing Jace, a random song that somebody else picks. Yeah, they used to have a I, song I, on guitar here. I, I feel like we probably can't do that on here. I guess. No, we can't. Listen, yeah, that's why, yeah, that's why you can't. Do I, that. I told my wife about ten years ago. I said, if Faith No More ever reform, I'm going to see them no matter where they are. They reformed in like 2010 or something like that, and they played in Toronto, and I flew to Toronto just to see them. Couldn't, and it nice. was like it was an amazing concert. Was like, I'm not, wow. this yeah, like not, not, not only was it an amazing concert, I got to meet the band and get my picture with them all. Man, oh, that's see, that's cool, cool right. shit. Yeah, I got a story. Let me tell did you the story. You an, uh, did they make you an honorary no, member? No, they didn't. No, they didn't. So here's the story. <gasps> so, nice. so, okay, so I knew they were coming to Toronto. I got a buddy of mine that lives in Toronto, and I call him up. I say, hey, you want to come to see Faith No More with me? Because I, you know, it's it's funner to go with friends, and he said, oh, yeah. "Sure." I said, "I said, okay." So I, I said, "They're coming on this date. Um, I'll buy the tickets. You just, you know, find the uh, the venue, and then you you uh, provide the transportation." Because I'm Toronto's a big city, right? I said, "You you provide the transportation, and we'll you know we'll go together, and everything will be great." So I get to Toronto. He picks me up at the airport. Take, takes me to his condo because he lives in a condo and I said so is he, have you figured out where the venue is he says yeah it's not too far away I said perfect how long is it going to take us to get there he says about two minutes I said what do you mean two minutes he says look out the window it was across the street from his fucking condo nice. oh, shit. no word of a lay it was across the street from his condo so of course we didn't hurry to get to the concert or anything so we sat on his deck and we drank beer for like two hours before the concert oh yeah Oh, yeah. Uh, so, like, n- no word of lie, like, less than, like, a half hour before the concert starts. He said, let's go over. So we walked over, got in line. It was, like, the line wasn't huge at all because it, was, it wasn't a huge venue. It wasn't, like, a stadium. It was more yeah. like, a, like a theater type thing. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Went in. He said, these are the tickets. And I was like, holy shit, we got great seats. We were pretty close to the stage. It wasn't standing room. It was all seats, right? We watched the show. The show was Fucking amazing. Absolutely amazing. Show got over. We actually, sorry, before that, we went up to the stage, got our pictures done at the, got our pictures taken at the stage with some people and stuff like that. But it wasn't the band. It was all fun. Concert happened. Concert was great. Concert was done. We left. And we, as we were walking out of the place, we see all these people kind of gathered in one area. And I said to my buddy, I said, what do you think they're there for? He says, they're probably there to see the band. I said, well, you think they're going to see the band? He said, no, the band left long ago. He said, the, as soon as the band left the stage, they probably got into their bus and left. So those people are waiting for nothing. I said, okay, so let's go get a bite to eat. So we went down to this restaurant, and we had, like, nachos, you know, finger food, and, and a few more beer. And uh, so we've had our food. It started to rain. We got back. To, we walked back to his uh, condo, and we're, look, we're sitting on the patio looking down, and there's still a crowd. At the theater, standing around. I was like, they can't still be waiting for the band. Are you kidding? This is crazy. He says, maybe there's something going on. And then all of a sudden, we hear the crowd. And they're like making like cheering noises and stuff. Like, I said, holy shit. Do you think that's the band? He said, get I don't know. Hoot, get, he said, get your jacket on. <laughs> no word of a lie. I put my jacket on. We go down the elevator. We cross the street. 
and we fucking meet the band. We get the pictures done with all the members of the oh, band. Yeah. Yeah. I have I have a conversation with Mike Patton. He he says wow. to me, "Where are you from?" I said, "I'm from Nova Scotia." And then someone in the back goes, "Nova Scotia, isn't that where they eat caribou?" Wow. <laughs> and he looks at me. He goes, "He goes, you guys eat caribou there?" I said, "I I've never eaten caribou, but regardless, nice to meet you." <laughs> <laughs> like I'm from your, I'm from your tour van. When, when midlife crisis came on uh, last Friday, when I was listening to my sound check, you know, play no more. I was like, yep, that's. I remember Jay telling me about that story, the story you just told again. I was yeah. like, when you met, when you met him. <laughs> yeah, and I talked to like the dudes from Jackal. You guys ever heard of that band? Yeah, I've heard of them. I don't know if I've ever listened to anything about them though. Yeah, I know I mean, Jackal. They, yeah, they would come to, yeah, old. they would come to like, they would come to like little shit small towns like ours and shit and play on the back of a flatbed tape trailer and shit like, you know like, what i'm saying like, this is this is a shot of like a like a snapshot of my playlist i got hey man nice shot from filter low filter i oh, love yeah. that, that love that's those. good shit yeah. Yeah. jesus built my hot rod ministry oh ministry yeah uh, nice awesome song. Uh, man. unsung helmet thunder ding, kiss ding, 65 ding dang dong ding dong ding dong ding dong ding dong ding dong thunder kiss 65 mm. white zombie yeah, that's good scene damn e- brother e- epic faith no more Slater, yeah. Velvet, Velvet Revolver. That was at that was what's his name's days after STP. Um, he's dead now. I can't think Velvet of Revolver, name. yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly, yeah. Oh yeah. Um, Ryan, Wyland. Yeah, yeah, Scott yeah, yeah, Wyland. Scott Wyland. Yeah, yep. Scott Wyland. Yeah. Just one fix. Ministry. More human than human. White zombie. Coaches. Audio slay. Welcome to the fold. Filter. Renegades of funk. Rage against the machine. Yeah. Man in the box. Allison Chains. Uh, the outside of perfect circle. The beautiful people. Marilyn Manson. Milk toast. Helmet. Wood. Allison Chains. Um, Spoon Man, Sam Guard, Midlife Spoon Crisis. Man. Hey, look at all these great '90s fucking just you know. Them, those... them Bones, Allison Chains. Oh yeah. Uh, just had Allison Chains, dude. Those motherfuckers. Just like I said, they, they... bring the noise. Anthrax, Indian oh, yeah. Lincoln Park, Lincoln that's Park. Good, you you gotta start watching the Anthrax documentary that's on YouTube. So it's Sex. their it's their Sex 40 types. year yes, yeah, their 40 year anniversary. It's Anthrax, Momo. Sex, t- Sex type thing. Stone Temple Pilots. That's still a fucking amazing Momo. song this day. Yeah, like Rooster, it. Allison Chains, One Step Close to Lincoln Park, Black Sunshine. Black Sunshine. Uh, Sleep in the Fire, Rage Against the Machine, Cowboys from Hell from Pantera. Love that Man, fucking yeah. awesome song. Man, what's Fuel, dude? Cemetery Gates from Pantera, Fuel, Metallica, Somewhere what I Belong. What a playlist this would be. <laughs> that's an awesome fucking, it, that's a, and this is half of That's an awesome fucking <laughs> playlist. Dude, oh my people. God, like, cream your jeans on that one. Dude, I'm that's sitting there. When I'm listening to this album, it just energizes me, man. Cause every fucking time that's it comes cool. on, it kicks ass. <laughs> that's good, Jago. Jago, that was, that was good shit. I'm gonna have to re-listen to the. I'm gonna re-listen to the podcast later, like all of you should. And I'm yeah. going to make a. I'm gonna playlist make out of everything he said. A playlist Damn out right. Of everything you just said. Damn right. Rooster. And I encourage everybody to do that. Yeah. Allison Chains, Machine Head, Bush, Black Sunshine, Cowboys from Hell, Lecture Head Part Two, White Zombie, Bush, yeah, um, Cemetery Gate, I like Red Bush. Hair. Are we, oh, we're talking about the band. The we're ultimate, talking about the band, like, sorry. From where I belong. <laughs> from, from where I belong, Lincoln Park. This is the ultimate um, thing that happens when you make too good of a first album. Here's one, Cold of Personality, Living Color. I love that song. It was so, the, they were no, so good Cold they had to change their name. Here to stay, Corn, Tick, Helmet, Bodies, Drowning I, I listen to Corn. Like, like, I, I, I play Corn playlists all the time. Y'all want to see say, fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck, fuck that. You all want to see the same Boom, boom, yeah. boom, 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 boom. Yeah, there you go. Yep. Angry again. Mega death. Fools on parade. Brains against the machine. There you go. Yeah. Um, gasoline. Sorry. Audio slave. Fucking awesome song. Know your that's enemy. That's a good one. I say, that's, that's my song. Like, I know your enemy. Rage against the machine. Know your hoot nanny. Uh, <laughs> my name is my name is Mud Primus. 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 I still love Primus to this day. Yeah. Did you know that? Did you know that? That he uh, applied to play bass for Metallica, and they basically told him he was too good. Really? Yeah. yeah I heard about that. <laughs> yes. Clean my wounds yeah, from right. corrosion. Yeah, and Les Claypool is an amazing bass player. Fuck yeah, he is. Yeah. Pearl Jam, Even Flow, In Bloom, Nirvana. Um, I'm broken. That's a fucking awesome song. I'm right there. broken. I'm broken. And yeah. Push it, Static X. Hey, hey Jago. Hey Jago. Jago. Where are you, Jago? Yeah. 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 What's this list coming from? Is this like just your songs? This, 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 is... this was the, when Spotify asked you what what kind of songs or like what, what kind of genres and stuff you I like. I thought you were talking about Salt and Pepper. Push it. 
Yeah, is this like no, your, is no. this like uh. your top songs or you just kind of? Yeah, like, this, this is this is this is my top song. Once once I told Spotify, well, dang, a lot of top songs. Once once I told Spotify, I love your top songs. Your top songs are good. Once, once I told Spotify what I liked, it it, it pretty much uh, compiled a list for me, and it's and it's all these. <laughs> oh well, once, that's yeah. Okay. I was like, wow. that's fucking awesome. Hey, yeah, hey, right. you guys. Yeah, I and mean, have like, you yeah. ever heard of Life of Agony? Oh yeah. <laughs> you, mean, you, mean, you, you mean what I live every day? <laughs> oh, wow. Life of Agony. That's your name. Life of Agony. It's an actual battle. It's like the battle. Well, that was a great list. That was a great list. Damn it definitely right. needed some Bloodhound Gang and some Peak Floyd. Yeah, and, and good old um, bit of Fear Factory. Well, Fear you know, Factory, yes. You know, I love Fear Factory. They just released a new album. But you, well, yeah, you had a good list. This list don't have like rapids of it. That's another list. Like you don't have like uh, Insane Clown Posse. That's on another list. And, uh, Bugs on my American, nuts. American Bugs on my nuts. Charge. That's a good song. That's a good American song. Head Charge. They're quite good as well. I just listened to that one the other day. Bugs on my nugs. I got nugs on my, or bugs on my ball sack. Bugs on my nugs. It's a clown posse. It's an acquired taste. I will tell you that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hell, they used to wrestle. They had the wrestle thing. I was going to oh, say, yeah. dude, I, I went to ECW one time and they were coming in the next you know, night. And they, and they had the weirdest. No, that was the they same guy. The no, 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 the no, those are the same guys, dude. Like, I had no idea. Yeah, those are the same guys. Those same guys, guys I, learned that, I learned that today, guys. Congratulations. I was a day year old when I figured that shit out. What was it? Those motherfuckers were weird, dude. Like, yes, they they yes, they did. Yes, they did. It was backyard wrestling, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they did. Backyard wrestling. It was, it was an ECW game or something, wasn't it? Yeah. Nope. Oh, that. Nope. No, no, no. It, it was your own game. Wrestling. Oh, okay. Backyard wrestling. 2001. wrestling. Yeah, I'm not to New Jack. On, God rest his soul. Good man. Not really a good man, but a good hardcore. Mm, you know, like, but he died. I don't know. I probably did too much coke, right? I would, I would guess. If I put any money time, down, I'm saying he did heart too much coke. He said he would guess. I'm gonna just gonna, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah so time. there you go. He had a heart attack. There you go. Yeah, back at Wrestle Xbox did you guys, and um, PS2. Did you guys ever? Okay. Oh, they have a uh, documentary like series on um, A and E or something like that. It's called um, Vice. It's on Vice, and it's called Beyond the. What is that called? Dark Beyond side. The Dark side. Dark side, Dark side, of, the side ring. of the ring. And they had a show about New Jack, and that's one of the best shows they ever did. And he was on that show while he was still alive. And I highly recommend if you can find that on your, if you can find that on your Hulu, or any shit. If you haven't seen that, that shit's great. Yeah. And and who else was on that cover? Yeah, the Cl Insane Clown Posse. They were hardcore. ECW was hardcore. I wouldn't watch those shows. That shit was fun. Love that shit. But that's beside the point. New Jack, hardcore. That's the most hardcore person I've ever seen besides that person that I, that other guy that like, I can't even remember his name. He does for like the CZW or whatever. And they hit each other with like white bulbs and panes of glass and shit. That's, that's beyond stupid, but you know, do, right there. Do, do, Doomsayer said, I should have been on tonight. You boys talking music. I said, we talk anything and everything, Doomsayer. Yeah. Where are we going to run this train off you know, the rails? I, did, I struck that up with, the, just ask him what your intro music would be. Mine. If I went with the video game, a song would be the Streets of Rage 2 boss song. Hmm. Right? You uh, know, see, mine would be the theme song. Might be the title screen song. Okay, and that would be a good one too. That would be the great, original, Mike. The first one, the first Streets of Rage. Yeah. Streets I of love Rage that. I love so, that soundtrack. It's a great soundtrack. So mine, if I'm walking out, I wish we could play that song right now. Give me the boss. The Boss Streets of Rage 2 song. That would, would be my shit. I'm mine telling would, you, dude. My, mine would be the Red Shoe Diaries intro from Skinamax. Back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> and you know why it was called Skinamax? Because he'd rub it so hard, the, the skin would be sore. <laughs> I, I knew that would throw y'all off. I knew that would throw y'all off. <laughs> <laughs> do, any of you, do any of you guys remember Cool Spot? Some of the music that you said on that Oh, game? yeah. Oh, yeah. So, so, guess, who did, guess, who did the, guess who did the soundtrack for Cool Spot? Okay. Now, now you guys got me wanting to play Cool Spot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go play Cool Spot. Cool Spot was awesome. Um, I gotta go in a couple minutes because I got some event planning to do with some buddies of mine, but I wanted to... So, so Make It Ice Team Productions is in the chat because he got lured in by you playing, uh, playing Sega Master System games. Yes. There. Um... 
that dude, Rich Needs Subs, he does some incredible uh, Sega Master System streams. I, wa I watch all of his streams Sega because you know why? It gives me that nostalgia what? tingles. Mike, yep. what's his, what's his Guys, name? Everybody bacon, ice bacon Ice Cream? Bacon Ice Cream Productions. Yep, every, everybody in the chat, I want I hit him up. to go I hate get him to much. his channel and uh -huh. sub. He just got over 400. I want to get him to 500. Damn I want to get him to right. 1,000. What's his but channel called again, Mike? Bacon, bacon Ice Cream okay. Production. Okay, okay. Hold on. Here, here's again. the easiest way to find him. Go to the description in the Retro yes. Renegades. Oh, that's right. He's part of the Gamers United they Guild. They are part of the okay. Gamers United right Guild. Down right there. He's right down there in the Guild. And, and, and let me tell you, you can't find a nicer guy than... than Retro Rich. I mean, is he, he nicer is... than you, Mike? Yes. Yeah, he actually is. Well, that's I, debatable. Uh, I, I, have, I have been known to lose my lose my temper on a podcast here and there. I've never heard that man raise his voice. Oh, I don't ever raise my voice either, so I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm in the same <laughs> level. Oh, I'm in the no, same level with a, him. This, this, is, this is a good oh, man no that needs, he needs... He is exactly... Is, not only is he exactly the type of of person that exemplifies the Gamers United Guild, but he is exactly the kind of person that, over all of the other nonsense on YouTube and the stuff we were talking about earlier, and Twitter, that's a guy. That's a guy that needs. He deserves not needs. He deserves the traffic that other sites that don't deserve it get. So. I need everybody a, in the chat to hit up. Once Rick, again, up what's his name again? What's his name? I got it. Retro Rich. Rich. Look on yeah, the Retro Rich. I'll post this link. But I'm no, going to tell you one thing. He is the best pointer you'll ever see. Uh, there is Bacon talks, Ice Cream Productions right yep. there. Yes. Bacon he Ice Cream Productions. After the show, I'll be hitting you up for a subscribe because I bet you, if if Mike here says you're a good guy, well, I guarantee, I guarantee you're a great guy. I mean, so, as soon as Mike introduced him bacon. to me, I, I was so I excited because of the Master System focus. So excited. Yep. Well, and I see I'm, him I'm, in the chat sometimes, and he's never nothing but the positive. Master System. I guess I'm going to unsubscribe from this shit. You, you're a dickhead. You're <laughs> 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 oh, okay. a dickhead. Well, Mike, Mike, brother, Yo, that was awesome you. for you to share that too. And man, it's always a pleasure to be on a podcast with you, and hopefully we can. Uh, Spend about five, six. Wait, wait. What's the record on your podcast anyway? Five hours. Uh, five hours. Five All right. hours. Well, we're gonna be spending five hours and four minutes and twenty seconds. So we're gonna beat that record. All right. My Mike ain't built to do five hours again. I'm really not. <laughs> okay, no. Okay. You know what? I'll I'm take really two hours. Not. I'll take, dude. I would take an hour and, on your and, podcast and be fun. Nah, Amigo. Mike only needs thirty nah, minutes. Amigo. He's done. Amigo. Thirty minutes. Be. Jesus Not Christ, I only needed seven minutes. Not I only needed need a couple. Dude, Chris, Chris fell asleep. Good Chris trip. fell asleep on that stream. He's like, I, I gotta go. Oh, they all? I, they all. Like, like I said, I, like I was telling those guys earlier in the, it, before the show, I fell asleep when I was streaming on Mixer one time a game. I fell oh, asleep. Oh, me too. Even a game, yeah. Yeah, all right. Me all right, too. so yeah. That's what I'm saying. They... <laughs> so yeah, I don't feel so bad. So, but yeah. We need to go. So we need to go back, and Jay, you need to go back and clip yourself saying you're a dickhead, and make that a soundbite. <laughs> <laughs> no, Yo, I need. I need. I need. No, I need Yo. Yobi to say it so that I can use his video clip. Yo, oh, so, yeah. yo, do you it, know you're that, dickhead. Yo, do you know that? Um, I think once you have like super chat on, on your on your YouTube channel, I know you, you start... need a super chat. No, 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 no. What's I mean, like, chat? Like, um, YouTube uh, allows you to clip things now, but I think you have to be, uh, uh, you got to be a, uh, what you do you call that? YouTube partner. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Partner? You, Is it a partner? You, you, you guys realize we're only 103 subscribers away from a thousand on this channel, right? Well, Is that everybody, if you're listening and you're not subscribed. Come on, guys. Yeah, just press that subscribe. It doesn't yeah. it doesn't hurt what you at all. Wrong like, with yeah. you people? What the hell is wrong with you people? <laughs> we're we're yeah, in the Now, Mike, that's what the hell is 
I'm We're telling you, all you have to do is reach up there. It's not even gonna, like gonna hurt your phone. It's like a dirty no. thing. You're not, not even gonna you. notice any fucking different unless you press the bell. We did get two new subscribers then, tonight, though. We were at 895 at the beginning, right? We're, 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 at, eight, not, we're at 897 subscribers. Yeah. Come on, people. This is like You're a subscribe. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Do it. <laughs> We've had an awesome chat tonight, man. Okay. I bet you yeah. every, every it, one of these it, cool it, cats in this chat have, if they weren't subscribed, I'll bet you they have subscribed. I know I got a couple people listening tonight that that they're not in the chat because they don't have like a, I think you have to make a channel or a, like a name or something. Because that's what Jesse said. He's listening right now. Jesse, what's up, bro? He's listening. He's texting me and saying, say it as cool, you know? So if, if anyone you know, has, any, Jesse. if we have any yeah. new subscribers, we are going to send you um, topless pictures of infinite. Hit the like button. It doesn't cost you to subscribe, and and okay. you're gonna get topless pictures of who? infinite. infinite. Oh, yeah. I, I might you even shave my chest. You can have I might one even of me. Shave the chest, all right, guys. And if you, yeah. you guys can see this well, cup all day long. <laughs> and if you don't, if you don't subscribe, we're sending Jeepers Creepers to your house to fucking wear your face. <laughs> see, see now the repercussions. You don't want the repercussions. It's just subscribe. It's call it done. Call it a day. Well, Speed if you remember, it. if you remember the first Jeepers Creepers movie, that boy's face is—he's got like a his face at the end. It's his skin. He had a game. <laughs> I love you guys, man. I, I, this is awesome, man. I love being on this show, man. This is this is as great as it gets right here. And look at this all-star panel. Oh, definitely an awesome this funny down thing. here. Doomsayers, man. If, if you want to come on, brother, you just let us know. You'll be, you're welcome. Of course. Any person yeah, that's ever been on the show is always welcome. Doomsayer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah Doomsayer, oh, come on in. Masuko said you guys make it awful hard to turn down. Thank you. <laughs> I, will, I will definitely make it hard enough for you not to be able to turn it down. Trust me. <laughs> Don't Why? let him fool you. He's been Why? hard the whole time. <laughs> Alright, well, with that, guys, I gotta scoot so I can get some stuff done. Love you, Mike. Mike, you good, yeah, Mike. Mike, Thanks, Mike, 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 Yes, this sir. is what it's all about. Damn so, right. We will, uh, if you're not having you guys, fun, if you're not having fun streaming, you're doing it wrong. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Right. If, this, if this is work for you, find a better job. That's exactly. right. <laughs> Damn Mike, right. Guys, I look See forward you, to being on with you on your show soon, babe. It's going to be a great time. Right. Yep, I got, I, got you, I got you, doggy. I'll DM you. The spreadsheet, baby. I got you on the <laughs> spreadsheet, brother. All right, all right. baby. Good night. Good, Mike. Good night, brother. That is Mike. You're so special. I, I'm not even on a spreadsheet yet. Did he, did he say oh, spread? Man. Did he, did he say spread cheat, a spreadsheet or spread cheats? <laughs> does, does, does it matter? It's one. I was at, I was, I was it sounded the same singular. Thing. singular. Singular. It sounded singular. Uh, I'd watch out for that. Uh, that, that, that <laughs> in my <fight>, doggy. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this? Uh, uh, you might get more than you ask for. If, 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 if you're more than you ask for. If you're in my ask for. If you're in my if you're in my cup with lube and a ball gag, I'd run. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. So this sounds creepy. This sounds creepy. Well, I also yeah. go in handcuffs. Oh. Run, right? <laughs> the hell is just this? Right against your ankles, you ain't going nowhere. I feel like there's bats and Halloween spooky shit flying around. Okay, yeah. All right. Okay. Okay. No more. No, no more ONLG podcast. <laughs> What's going on, Dotka? Vodka's in the house. He's, yeah, he's been here. He's been here. What up? Uh, well, you know, I'm playing games. Every so often, I, I get to look over. I know it's hard. Man. It's hard. <laughs> you guys are great, man. This is so fun. Like, I appreciate this so much. We appreciate, we appreciate people wanting to hang fun. out with us. Honestly, man, we have so much fun. Like we yeah, we, right? we outdo I mean, ourselves every week. Like I say on this show, you can be relaxed and you know, be yourself. Yeah, and there's no yourself. like, there's no like, bullshit in here. Everybody's just here. real. Everybody's just real. We talk about the games we play and shit. You know, we just, you know, we, there's we, no. We go off on music tangents or movie yeah. tangents or food or what the Tangent! Fuck? I remember last <laughs> time I was Mr. Tangent. I thought that was my new name. I forgot about that. Yeah. 
Uh, I was going off at tangents all the last time. Yeah, just talk. Yeah, exactly. You could go off at tangents on this show. There's no topics. You just come in here. You drink some fucking beers. That's your topic. That's Hang right. You, hey, so what, what beer have you drank and how drunk are you? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not drunk yet, but I get, I'm starting to get a buzz. Exactly, and that's all that matters. Is the, 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 well, I'm on beer, no, I'm on beer number five, so I'm, we didn't I'm do feeling our great. Job, then we didn't do our job if Jago isn't drunk enough. Nah, well, Crispy's got me beat. I think he drinks faster than I do. So I'm gonna be drinking tonight. <laughs> uh, who is the? Who is the? Who's the like? You know, amongst us, you know, amongst uh, like the community of everybody, like everybody knows, who's like the drunkest of the drunk guy? Who's who's the drunk guy of the of the podcast community? Who drinks the most? I'd be oh. Husk. Husk, I'd say Husk. Husk, if you're listening, dude. Cheers, emoji. How, how many how many beers does Husk drink in one night? Fourteen. I think he drinks eight pack per show. I fourteen. Know. I was gonna say fourteen. Yeah. <laughs> I I think I think his limit. I think it's usually about seven or eight. I think we've countered a few times, like seven or eight. Well, no, you got to remember. Sometimes he said he's had three or four or five before. But the prior show, show too. That's <laughs> exactly. You always have to have the prior show. That's that's that, when that's I know I'm going to be up. on a podcast. I come home a little early and start putting some down. You even, know, get ready. You know, what I'm saying, even, smoke even, a few pinchies. Smoke a what? A who? Pinchies. Pinchies. Smokes pinchies. Pinchies. Okay. Okay. I've never heard that term man. before. Even Hus. Even Dripple said Hus. Well, if I smoked like a, if I smoke like a, like a bong or like a doobie or some shit like that before I come on here, I'd be even more Rich. doggy dog than I am already. Yeah, so, yeah, it could be like, yeah, it could be dangerous for everybody. So. My problem, so, my my problem is I would give up booze if I could handle weed, and it's free. It's it's illegal in Canada, right? The no, it's legal. Is, yeah, it's legal. Yeah, it's legal. Yeah, it's legal, legal here. Legal. Problem is. It seems to it's give legal me. Legal Illinois too. It's, it seems to give me a stomach. Like every time I try it, it gives me a stomach ache. You mean smoking it? Yeah, smoking it, taking edibles, anything it gives me a stomach ache. Yeah, edibles I can understand. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I don't know what. Oh, you is. got a bad edible. Damn, that sucks. That. I wish I could. Oh, I know. I know quite a few people that had like bad, bad times with the edibles and shit. Like really? Um, I yeah, can't like... drink beer and smoke. I get I get the spinsies. I thought. Yeah, away. yeah, you get the spins. Yeah, exactly. If I smoke too much and I'm like drinking fucking I, too much, yeah, oh I, yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I, yeah. Spinsies, I, just, I like that. And then get major munchies. <laughs> oh just, yeah, that too. My fat ass don't need that. Problem. Munchies are gone now. I don't get munchies anymore. I, you gonna I, say jiggle? I, I, quit, I always have the munchies. I, I quit. I quit smoking weed back in the day after I fucking I fucked up uh, anxiety attack. So every, now every time I I have smoked after, Bears. I, 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 I get I get. Uh, uh, exactly. par- 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 or that, I'm feeling like feeling like that, or I get and and or I get paranoid. Listen to Fierce, everybody, 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 say to Fierce that he's a he's 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 not a real Canadian. You're a fake Canadian, Fierce. You're a fake, fake Canadian, Canadian. Fierce. Fuck. <laughs> I, I did not. I did not cheat the system. I did not know the answers before the question came out. I won the that shit fair and square. You mother. You're supposed to be on my side. You're Canadian. <laughs> what's, he, what's he talking about? What, what'd, you okay. win? what'd you win? Clowns so yes, show, yes, clown show from last night. Yeah, so yesterday, Clowns was giving away a ton of shit, and he asked a question, and I answered the question, and I won the I won the shit. And what was Fierce, the Fierce said that uh, that, it, that I cheated because I knew the answer. Hey, Everybody, what was the question? It was it was about what is the newest um, animated show uh, uh, about Marvel that's on Hulu. And I knew it was MODOK. So I just said MODOK and I won. Oh, well, I couldn't have told you that because I don't even watch I fucking couldn't. Hulu. Yeah, yeah I don't damn. fucking watch cartoons anymore. <laughs> uh, yeah. Damn. Yeah. You, like, yeah, I'm, I'm with you on that one, Jago. I do not yeah, watch cartoons. Oh, listen to this guy. He's too wisdom. fucking bougie to watch fucking cartoons. No, I don't. <laughs> And I spent the first 15 years of my life in some Spider-Man oh, Underoos on Saturday shit. morning <laughs> eating my bowl of cereal, all right? Yeah. Look, no, no offense. Uh, no Underoos, I forgot about that. No offense to people who still watch <laughs> hey, car- cartoons and anime. I just don't watch that shit anymore. Unless it's something I grew up with. That's what I'm saying what? Like Thundercats or something. That's very, Dark- very hard. Thundercats, dude! Oh, 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 my son went to his new dude. face. Oh, or, X, or, or, the, or X-Men, the animated series. You know, that's yeah, something I grew up on. I got to Scooby-Doo not too long ago. Hey! I see that Dreadpool will put that Husk only. So Husk has the record on a um, podcast for a six pack? 
All right. No, more All right. I'm, more I'm, gonna, I'm gonna crush that tonight. That's what yeah, Dred that's said. Dred says he must. He must normally drink a six pack. Yeah, beforehand. Must, beforehand, yeah. right? Mm. Beforehand. I was gonna say, I know Hus. Hus drinks. Yeah, he drinks. Dude, that guy's always cracking a beer, dude. He's said. always cracking a beer, dude. Yeah. He starts with a six pack. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. yeah there you go. Exactly. I, I was gonna say he drinks like, way more than six. Like that's what I'm saying. Husk is like a plane. He's already took off. He like he's already hit. He's already took off. No, like, Husk, Husk is like a sponge. He just pours it in and he absorbs it. <laughs> well, but I'm saying, he has, like, he's already he's already going. But no, he fine. has a pee break every, like, 30 minutes. His, his, I know, yeah. His rental fees yeah. must be out the roof. Husk is like, Husk is probably, yeah, he's probably the champion beer drinker. Uh, you know what? Uh, I want to get on. Hey, we should have him on here. I want to have been me been and him. Been out here. Well, me and him need to have a beer drinking contest. Can I have <laughs> Husk and beer, but Husk and me we'll graphic god contest graphic god i know you're not here but fierce play x fear or fierce play says you give poutine a bad name <laughs> <laughs> he's coming back what the fuck yeah, one, pee break? Hour. one hour one hour pee break yeah. Yeah. of I course i had to go for a few i drank like a ton of beer I, I, like, I, I don't even have another beer See, I, 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 I need a refrigerator sitting here beside me because they like just disappear jay read fierce plays uh uh, response to you in chat. What does he say? He said, You're still a cheater. You know what I'm talking about. Graphic God, you give Poutine a bad name. <laughs> <laughs> That's terrible. I like Donaires better than Poutine, by the way. So Jay said he's okay with it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, gentlemen, guess what? It's that time. It's that time. Damn it. It's that time. We have so much uh... fun. And it's just as the time way. flies. And we gave no fucks. As I say, time flies at one time of fun. You damn okay. right. Exactly. That's what is that why fucking work takes a goddamn long time? <laughs> yeah, because you don't have fun. <laughs> hey Graf hey, God, I yeah. think he was gone during the time hey, can I I request a beer drinking contest with Husk on oh, the yeah. first time. He did, he did. Yeah. We'll have to do that. We have to get Husk on again. It's been a while. Husk and me beer drinking what contest the and you know fuck? we gotta you see dread. what we... the dress that he wanted dread? to leave. Yeah, dread what's in? Okay. Dread that he wanted oh, to leave oh. earlier. No. Toss boot. You know what? Yeah, let's do. Oh, this we shit. should get Meg right. in too, cause I need I need a Canadian to help me out. Yeah, get Meg. Right. The one so, time, yeah. the, the one time the Meg first... was on here, I got him on here. Then I had to go out the fuck out of town. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna have the first ever, the first ever retro renegades, beer drinking contest. Oh, that well, would be official, a crazy official. night too. Official beer. The official. Oh, well, official. Yeah. Because I'm pretty sure it's the beer. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah, we're having that tonight. How People many times? People have been plastered Dude, many I've been times putting them. I've been putting them down. It has to be on camera. It has to be on camera. Yeah. Oh, okay. 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 All right. I got to Okay. I'll get I'll get a camera. That's cool. I got you. That's a good point. I want to say thank you, Jeepers, for fucking hanging out with us again, you fucking broad. Thank you for having me. Listen, there's no. Jeepers, there's I, no having you. That's just you show up. I know, and... I know, I know. I plan on being back. Thank Trust you. Me. So My glad. fucking time. So the invasion of the body snatchers came, went, came and got you. And they're like, no, yeah. you no never been exactly again. They took me away, man. They took me a while to get back. We're just glad you're here. Yeah, we're, we're just glad you're here. And for yeah, all you people that have not, cool. for all you people that don't know, Jeepers was an original uh, retro renegade. He was. Well, yes, yeah, he was. That's right. Yeah. And an awesome voice on top of that. An and awesome a, voice. And used to have a YouTube channel too, FYI. I'm going to start doing reviews again. Yeah, nice. you, you used to do uh, some to. awesome, awesome content. You're going to start with that new Switch, all right? Oh, my God. Yeah, It'll exactly. be the shortest, the shortest review ever. <laughs> yeah, it has a new screen. Oh, let's talk on, about it. You put that on Facebook Minutes, all right? Unless you start bitching about the fact that you're mad that you bought it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, no. I'll, I'm... I'm reviewing indie games because that's what that's, that's what, that's what you do. But hey, yeah. I'm, I'm just glad Andy's you can, cool. I'm, I'm glad you're back, Andy. brother. Yeah. Oh you were, yeah, definitely. You were gone for long enough. I know, I know. Well, I uh, I bought a new house, so I gotta. I'm re renovating it, so. Oh, that's awesome. Cool. Uh, once I get it uh, all situated, I'm gonna set up the <clears> office <throat> and uh, start doing reviews again. You're gonna do what us nerds do: is set up a little streaming room. Yeah, I already have one where I live now, but I gotta move everything and set it up 
with the green screen and all that yeah. stuff. Yeah. Cool. It's funny, I just pulled the dust to my couch. What's that? I just pulled the desk with my PC and all the yeah. stuff on it to my couch. <clears throat> that sounds, that sounds yeah. like it sounds like me back. I just move. I just slide my recliner because my all my stuff, all this is in my man cave. So, but I just slide my recliner over to my PC and my mic. <laughs> can you believe what? Can, can you guys believe what he Here just said? All that shit, hmm. and then give ten bucks. That son of a bitch. What was it? What did he say? He said, you good stream guys to the Canadian's graphic god, you need to change your ways. There's hope for you. Much respect to the rest of the crew. Thank you, brother. Awesome. Nice job, Thank man. you. Nice job, brother. Appreciate it. Fierce, nice you're going to you're gonna get a, a tongue lashing. That's and not in a good way either. <laughs> oh, 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 I was really excited. Woo. Well, you're gonna, you're gonna give him a rimming, are you, Jay? <laughs> I thought that was like the party gift for being on the show. Yeah. Oh, oh did you sign the contract? Oh, oh. <laughs> no. You signed and dotted any game in it twice. This is, where, this, this is where the invite from OG NLG comes in, doggy. Oh, see. Oh, shit. <laughs> I can hear the million dollar man with everybody has a practice. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for showing up. We'll see you guys next week. Evan will go to Evan. will be playing something spectacular, I'm sure. I'm just having no oh, clue yes. yet. We'll figure exactly. it out, though. That's okay. We'll see you guys next week on the oh, Retro yeah. Renegade. Retro Renegade.